tailbone. You'll knock out his two hearts on the left hand side. Hey everybody. I'm back. I ate a snack. And now it's time. Oh yeah, let me uh turn on that. Keep the stimuli flowing free. Yeah, mailman? You love Final Fantasy XIV? Well, you're in the right spot. Because there's you're about to see a lot of it. A whole lot of Final Fantasy XIV. I'm gonna join in the Discord with my raid crew. Elder Triton, thank you for the sub. Oh yeah, BB number nine, thank you for the sub. Reset while I'm away. Nobody did stop you. I can see that clearly. I don't know why somebody would want to. I don't want to stop you from subbing. All right, I'm gonna join in. Hello. Hey, everybody. Hey, how's it going? It's going great. Got some yogurt. Awesome. Got some coffee. Brain is primed. Does excellent, yogurt and coffee excellent. go together? Kind of, yeah, actually. I don't know how I feel about that, but kind of like do you. <laughs> I think it does. Let me uh, beep beep at the people. I mean, Ella and Naf are online. I mean, just watch Ella go into the house. Oh, dude, that you're playing the new World of Warcraft. Is it good? People like it. Start inviting people. Should have invited Dre. Well, no, because Dre went to the bathroom, so that wouldn't have worked anyway. I apparently am unable to join party. Probably because I'm in the middle of crafting something. Yes. Let me know if you need a second invite. No, it's still counting down here. Yeah, act fast, I agree. The fact that Lollafell just have to stand on the seat. I guess they must control acceleration with their hands, huh? I need to find the most embarrassing Lollafell mounts. Let's get them all. Embarrassing? Yeah, ones where I'm like emasculated. Okay, I need I need an example, I think. I thought that yeah. was being a Lollafell. Yeah, it generally is, but so like just little things like uh in the regalia, the car, how you stand on the seat to to be able to drive oh, really? it. Really? You do? Yeah. There's a lot of things with like Lollafell and, and like when you're on the back of something, they tend to just splatter out, like completely lay on their stomachs. Um, so I need to find the ones that make me look the most ridiculous. I thought there was one where like it carries, you get carried in something's mouth. Uh, there's many... one where you get carried by the hand. Oh, okay. The, there's yeah, the, the hand, hand one. Well, there's the monkey one. There's the gorilla too that you you just were on cash. That's, yeah, but everybody you know looks. Weird everybody on looks that. ridiculous in that. <laughs> you know, hot take. I would say Lala Fell is the manliest race because how secure you have to be to be one. You know. I like it. So specifically. Behavior. I like it specifically because it makes me sound better. Lala's. As long as you're not a Lala. <laughs> well, I'm already a real life Lala, so let me be my cat girl, okay? <laughs> <laughs> Is it okay if I park here? <laughs> it's a no parking zone. <laughs> Ooh. Just kidding. It's probably okay. I don't own that house. Thank you. Merry Christmas. <laughs> I mean, festival uh, Starlight. Merry Starlight? Happy Starlight? I don't know. Send the one. Oh, yes, I did. I don't know where she and Nap are. Besides online. Well, Nap, Nap joined the party. Yeah. Is there a way to change glamour? Not in the house. Here, okay. Apparently. Uh, they tried it and it crashed the servers. Oh, okay, weird. The test server. Mm. Yeah, it was something about like putting glamour dressers in player housing. There was some interaction that was making the servers <laughs> unstable. <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah. It's probably like memory limits because housing is already like the reason that they don't just make 
like 150 wards is because of memory limits with the server. So this is why I should always have just kept it free company, and you get your apartment. Uh, I don't care. And then whenever you're in like the places that you do have the dresser, so like uh, like the public ends or the the squadron room or anything like that, it like unloads a ton of stuff off the client, and I think that frees up the memory they need for that. How about the client side being... Well, for PS... PlayStations, it would be a problem. You have to be careful. Yeah, true. But I think server it's also server-side. Well, server side. It, well in mean... housing, yes, they're server side because all these mm -hmm. items are an instance of something that have to be mm -hmm. kept in memory on the server. Um. I don't know. Compared to housing, like it seems like glamour dresser shouldn't really be that big a deal, hmm. especially since it you put something in the glamour dresser. I'm pretty sure it strips all the customizations and stuff off it. Like, uh, uh, no, like it does with the armor. Does it not? Because the it, armor uh, does that. Yeah, I think it might take off the um, crafter, but uh, you can hey, nah. set it to be a certain you can dye it and have several yeah yeah uh it'll support dye but it's like they oh, tell you to way. repair it first and and yeah, uh, yeah. well I, I think that's just because they didn't just, want to get people Ian, thank you very much for the sub three months appreciate that three repairs yeah would, why would store that percentage oh, just, oh it make it repair I, well exactly the fact that it's not storing that like it doesn't store the full information about the item, just what it is and what, what dye you applied. All right. Anyway, I don't know. Um, I don't know. I haven't. <laughs> I've never developed an MMO, so I don't know all. The <laughs> I work in the lab. It makes sense. I've never developed an MMO, but I have run a server before, actually. I have multiple servers. I've got an actual uh, server, uh, rack server at home because there was a recycling center that uh, they sell those for cheap. Hmm. I uh, I've actually I picked up Core Keeper on sale today. I have that one too. That's a fun game. Nobody wants to pay. I picked it up because I want to give it a shot. Eventually. That's fun. It's trying, really uh, fun. Tribes Vidguard, which is going well. Oh, that's a hard game. I thought, you know, it's not hard as it is uh, kind of confusing and buggy. Uh, it's just very, I mean, it gets very repetitive. But... Oh, everyone's yeah, here. I'm putting on my clothes. Uh, have a Let me finish this craft real quick. <laughs> I gotta finish my ensemble. That's not important. Are you sure? Very important. Oh, the ensemble is the most important thing. I got my ensemble on. <clears throat> Let's make it look like armor. Good to go. <laughs> Good. Okay. Anybody have a problem with me trying uh, Dark Knight? Uh, whatever you feel comfortable working with. Whatever uh, you want. If, 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 if I fail difficulty it's just easy to switch to warrior again <clears throat> all right i'm ready I just, uh, let know, me the switch cool there we go not uh, or, uh, i do have food can we get company actions up let's see oh, wait do i have food i uh, kind of have food thank you for reminding me to get food proper care execute Oh, look, Vic knows how to use the company actions now. Is there a full cowboy set? I knew how. I didn't know. I don't know. Good to... question. I need to start <laughs> figuring out my fashion. And I used Everyone one of the company actions permission. the other day when I was doing a shit ton of crafting. I put up the crafting one for 10% more XP. <laughs> Why are they there? It's a nice book. No, they're there, there to look at. They. Oh, <laughs> what is it? <laughs> The Tsukiyomi Moonlit book. The 
is lit by a moon. In fact, there is a lighted moon on it. Sure, and some uh, secret letters in the uh, binding there. They say anything? No, they look like bad textures. My koala wants a story. All right, pudding acquired. <laughs> <clears throat> Alright, who are we waiting on? I think it was just... I think Vic was just putting the actions up. Oh, and... Uh, you know, they're up, they're up, they're up. Cloud uh, uh, said he was ready. I'm good. Oh. Right, he was... And gosh, come on. Mid lane to deplete again. Oh, okay. I just remembered. Hmm. Things. The things I needed to do, like figuring out everybody's... Uh, Best and slot and... Ah, well, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Do you have a sheet ready? Make me some... <laughs> uh, I mean, I have a sheet ready, but <clears throat> it's just not filled out with our information. Let's see here. I basically have, like, a blank form that I can start filling out. Oh, my God. So many people are but... streaming right now. What the fuck? That's fine. I had a crazy... I mean, Thanksgiving weekend, right? So... Fun. Uh, who are we waiting on? Somebody step away? I don't know. I looked away for a second. I got someone asking me about modems. Someone asked I can see why that's distracting. Modems? So weird. <laughs> no, we're not. On, we got to P5. It makes sense. It actually makes sense. It's good. We spent a long time on P4, so maybe that's... Talked about that being like the last one. Carbuncle, carbuncle, Oh, let's see if I can remember this fight already. <laughs> right. Hot right. new potions, I'm ready. Hmm. Uh, oh, okay, wait, hold wait. up, hold up. Food. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. <laughs> and... Oh, no! Food. Hmm? So get those buffs up, because I don't hear anybody hey. saying we need to cancel. I was trying to do it myself, but I forgot how. Uh, um, I think it's Arsenal? just slash CD space cancel. <clears throat> or, or just doing the countdown command again. First bit. Tank, get out of there. Oh my god. Oh, I got him. Like, okay. did I kill somebody? Oh, wait, he was with me, so. Cause, <laughs> no, he <laughs> killed himself. <laughs> I thought it was, I thought, all I heard was get out of here, and then I was like, wait, I think he said tank before. Shit. <laughs> he offed himself. <laughs> get near your pool. Uh, uh, yeah, two. Oh, no, no, you take one. Step in. We forgot about second mid again. Uh, I got it. This will be. No, this should still be first mid. Keep the, uh, keep the rest of it the same. Right, double dash. Gonna hang out uh, early. And start behind him. Start behind, be ready to go through him. Anti knockback. Oh, 
quadrants starting at three. And four again. And two. Your left stay through. Stay. God, this track is so good. And next will be super appropriate. Oh, hello. Sorry. Uh, I think it's okay. I can get it. I was not really paying attention to the fact that you were right next to me. Okay. Stacks or spreads are next. <clears throat> it is a Get ready. Spread. Spread. Box, box. Hey. Oh, Crap. I got rezzed into the. Yeah. Ugh, I'm sorry. Uh oh. I got, I got rezzed and I thought me, I was still Ella. in my spot. Listen, you ran at me too. and you killed me in broad Sorry, daylight. I had, a cash, I, got I had a cash moment. I think we just reset. Uh, yeah, unless we can get a lot of raises that quickly. But, uh, <laughs> no, no, not if we have to run around for that. The power time? Sorry, guys. It's time for me to do it again? No. You mean we didn't clear on the first try? Weird. We got really far, though. It... Yeah. I'm impressed with how much came back. That when it came. Yeah. As soon as we started, I was like, oh, boy. There's no nothing. Brain is empty and smooth and happy. <laughs> Same. I knew a lot of it once it happened, but I couldn't remember what was going to happen. Speaking yeah. Music, I need to turn mine back on. So we should be fine now. <laughs> There we go. Oh, was there stuttering? Uh oh. Now let me know. I would be surprising if it hit during this game. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, I think I remember how to play my class. Yeah, that's okay. No, no big deal. Just if anyone happens to notice it, I appreciate the, uh... Just trying to dial everything in. I want it looking pristine. <laughs> Ouchie. Thought I could get away with waiting. That hurt a little bit. Keep forgetting this fight wants me to heal for a living. Technically you did. Died. That's true. Efficient. All right. mm -hmm. uh, I forgot so my mitt. <laughs> Seeing that giant spike in DPS, I bet. First, second mitt will be on this buster. Since uh, since we don't need it for raid wide, second mitt, first buster. Oh, what the. Uh, got him. Oh. He got crunched. Uh, we're going to three. Get it in there. Hey, okay. come to one. I oh, am. Yeah. I didn't see you because all I saw was. <laughs> I got H rod. Okay. I keep cash alive. I think. Well, I don't know that he's going to stay alive. Yeah, I'm about to. It's okay. Pass. I took the. Uh, yeah, it was a... Okay. Oh, we should bit. probably go ahead and reset. Yeah. I didn't realize a bait was up. A... No, it was a light. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. Oh. Hey, what? Got me. Oh, Sheriff Sniffers. I've been playing 14 quite a bit lately, which I'm very, very happy about, but yeah. Oh, no, no, before that. It was before that. Got, got us a nice yeah, perma group. Sure. Oh, you've requested this song. It's really nice. Yeah, it's song. The greatest shame of me kind of not playing a lot of Pokemon is missing out on the music. Ooh, it stuttered thrice that time. Yeah, he was kind of like maybe at ninety percent. Have you tried? Hey, we do. I'm curious if you if you lower your the quality on your end, if the stutters would still will still happen, or maybe it's just stuttering. I tanked. I'll try to keep an eye on the CPU myself. Oh, 
punishment. Wow, who just did that? Oh yeah, we ran through poison. Oh, uh, okay, thank you. I'm back. <laughs> we barely got through there, man. Uh, There's two. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I got Following everyone second. didn't occur to me. <laughs> thank you. I, I actually, there's a thing that I know how to do that. Oh shit. Good one. Step in. Uh, fuck. Oh, we got it. Don't scare me like that. <laughs> You're gonna make me catch a heart attack. <laughs> catch a heart attack. Catch it. Like it's the flu. <laughs> in this day and age, you never know. Heavy COVID. That's a problem. That was a big hit! Yeah. You goddamn! A little bit ouchy. You're making me hit my big buttons. <laughs> my buttons. Snapshot is fucking early. Yeah, you can safely run in like, once he does the last attack. You can move into the animation of it. All right, so he's gonna double back early. So we're just gonna wait for him to hit on the right, and then we go across. Go. Okay, stay here. Find your markers, but stay here. And go. Uh, oh. remember, Cash, I don't... Yeah, yeah oh, he got it, though. He got it, he got it, though. Woo -hoo -hoo. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, like, yeah. I can't remember where my bark was, because I don't have one. You don't have one, yeah. <laughs> like, oh, shit, I don't remember having you, a mark. You're filling in, yeah, you're you're flexing if we need a... If we need one. Yeah, yeah, Cash, fill it in. Oh, my God. <laughs> Gross. <laughs> 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 All right. Uh, northwest. Northwest. Ranged and Cloud are on the edge. Oh, I'm on. I'm on the wrong one. Yeah, I'm here now. Cloud the ranged. Okay. We are going... Uh, staying away. Stay away from the boss. Oh, I want to play with him. 
I don't remember positioning here. Stay away from the uh, tank. The, tank's, the main tank's gonna go away. Uh, yeah, the main tank will move so he doesn't have to hit us. We don't have to go anywhere. Alright. We'll bring him back to the center, and then it'll be uh, the light party spreads. So, group one hanging out by Delta. Group two over here by Bravo. Oh. And this is the one where we, uh, yeah, four people on each side, and we're gonna do that little spread. Oh, right, oh, oh, and... So, we are not rotating. We can stay here. Just, uh, they'll be on the same side as the crystal. And our uh, healers will stay, range will go to the far corner. We're gonna collapse on tanks to bait, and then run forward again. Oh, oh. Uh oh I died, yeah. <laughs> Stack. Oh. Okay, I'm gonna spread out. Nope. Uh hoping <laughs> Okay. Yeah, because Mapa, I was gonna spread out hoping that they wouldn't both land in the same spot and maybe we could heal her I'll do. Didn't work out. Um Question, can we get a ref refresher on the towers here? Yeah. Is that just your normal towers or Oh, the towers there are just the normal towers, yeah. Uh, it's the exact same priority as the first set of towers. You guys on the other side uh, remember how that uh, spread pattern goes? Yeah, the spread was fun. It was just a big die to the... Uh, he stepped on the poison by accident. Yeah, and then his circle, like did, his circle exploded. Uh, so yeah, it's... Gotcha. We, we had no have... safe place to go. <laughs> it's corrosion. Yeah. Yeah, it's better... It's better... It's better Ooh, act fast. First for that drop and then Thank you for the sub. Time, rather than dropping close and then backing up. Because then... Uh, then, like... Since the parties are away from each other. Best Energy in 14, Row Hroth healers, and Lalafell tanks. Lalafell Dark Knight, especially wild. I I wanted to do Dark Knight. That's what I was hoping to do. I had a friend of mine join, and I was like, oh, baby. Oh, man, did you match the Kingdom Hearts video? That's awesome. Yeah, Lalafell Dark Knight is where it's at. I want to play that someday. Watch the poison. Oh, God, did I hit the poison? I got the poison. Fuck. You he uh, got the gooey on him. Oh, uh, and you're, <laughs> you're not a warrior. You can't yeah, just blood wedding. No, oh, go back. I can't target him. What the hell? There we go. Second minute. I think I just clapped at the boss by accident. Fine. <laughs> The boss is confused by your actions. <laughs> it's super effective. <laughs> okay. I'm going for Starting with three. 
Is there ever a time where we would do like a full circle around or no? Uh, no, that's not a possible pattern because the last, the uh, last movement from three to four is always diagonal. Okay, okay. I was curious. Yeah, that's just the consistent thing. Um, all right, stacks first, stacks first, then in, then block. First for one hit. Just one hit. <clears throat> and opposite the tower. And same pattern as last time. Double back early. So we'll just wait. Wait for it to hit three and go across. Stay over by two, but find your marker. And go. Shit, 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 shit. Okay, made it. <laughs> okay, next cast will be first pick. Anyone here that plays WoW, have you guys uh, started watching a stream for your Feldrake mount drop on Twitch? I need to log in and do that. Try not to pull him away. Itty bitty leaving space. <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah, just <clears throat> Sorry, I don't know who has threat at this point. So. That'd be Rod. It's Cash. Okay. No. No, no oh, I, Rod, yeah. Rod took the first hit. Okay. Oh, so technically, sorry. it's only it's actually just Rod that needs to go, but I, I'm not keeping track of that. I thought about staying behind, but. Alright, second myth. So this will be the uh, light party spreads again. So go to your light party sides. Group one over Delta. Uh, we are rotating north and south. Okay. Healers will stay. Range to the corner. Tanks in the back. We're gonna collapse on the tank after the spread. Oh, what the? And then go forward. I got cloud. I oh, thought we had to spread out after that part. Okay, you go. <laughs> no, you don't, you don't need to. I wasn't spreading for that. I was spreading because I saw a healer. We'll get the summit break. We'll get it. The stacks are going to go wild. Just kite oh. him. Just kite him. Well, idiot. Uh, <laughs> I fucked that spread up. I stacked before I sprint. <sighs> I'll get there. Okay. That one, that one is always squall. 100% of the time, it's always squall. So, it's always the same dance. Same song and dance. Mm -hmm. I don't think we held it off. I don't think it would be possible. You wear a helmet while you're playing a game? <laughs> oh, my snowman helmet. Where's my helmet? <laughs> hey, I could at any point bump my head. Safety first. I'd be attacked by a bear. I'm not in Canada, yo. <laughs> Got bears in. I was gonna say, pretty sure you got bears down there too. Going to four. 
you guys ever watch those like shorts? It was the how did how did, how you die machine or whatever. Oh, I'm not familiar. No. It's really funny. It's basically like a little machine. You put in a quarter and you put your finger in and it like pricks you and then it prints out like how you're gonna die, but very vaguely. And they're really funny. Like oh yes. So wait, it actually takes your blood just to just to give you a fortune? Well, it's it's supposed to be like predicting based off your blood. I'll, I'll see if I can find it on YouTube again. They're really funny. I died. Huh. You died? And it predicted that you would die that way? Uh, You're laughing? It probably would have predicted dying from laughter, yes. If that's the way I die, I would be okay. It's a great way to die. I agree. Now, as long as it's my laughter and not people laughing at me. <laughs> yes. You could bring joy to so many. Falling out of an airplane naked. <laughs> there, one of the guy's things is literally how you die. It's skydiving. Okay. And it gets it's so fucked up. What but was he naked? <laughs> no, not that part. But well, that's oh, assuming that you would get in an airplane to skydive in the first place. But then to top it all, you're also naked. Like that's a choice. It's a series of a unfortunate of mishaps. A lot of choices were made there. <laughs> trying to think of something that's maximally embarrassing like somehow the news has footage of you all the way down falling naked to your death one of them the guy puts it in it's like how you die and it says hot girl okay <laughs> sounds about right nice. sounds like dudes to me could literally be on fire and trying to give him a hug True. I think it's because you guys wait for the animation to complete all the way. Yeah, I apparently got hit by that too. That I don't know how might be what I'm all doing right. for sure. We're adjusting to the le uh, left side. We're gonna go left one corner first, and then go back across when it hits more. Back across. Find your marks and go to them. Nice. Yeah, that was the harder part. That was really clean. <laughs> it's funny because from our experiences now, it seems like the hardest mechanics we have no problem handling, but then there's like the easiest ones and we just <laughs> completely <laughs> fucking dysfunctional Can't on do it. Them. <laughs> First myth? No, that's, that's a real thing. And like, I don't just know that theoretically. I know that personally, uh, personal experience. <laughs> Uh, we're going northwest. northwest. Range group to the edge. Yeah, no, I know that firsthand, even from like years and years ago playing WoW. Uh, away from boss. That it's like sometimes it's like the reclears on earlier fights can be more difficult or, or sloppier than the um, than the new thing we're on. 
just because once you get too comfortable, uh, you start relaxing. Experimenting. You get too comfortable with the mechanic, and you start uh, you start to relax during it, and your focus slips because you're not taking it as seriously anymore. True. Second map. I remember editing the video inside gaming video review for uh, XCOM Enemy Unknown. So I used this music a lot. I remember getting a loop of it and using it in the review. A nostalgic. Back up. Drop the puddles and then go back in. Remain stacked. Remain stacked. What the fuck? Kill me! Just hope it goes in your group. Oh yeah, Chris. Links are totally fine. Also, there are no mods. Wait, what's? Oh, okay. <laughs> I have a bait. Yeah, Autobot gotcha, or Automod gotcha. We'll we'll just leave that one in the queue since it was a mistype. Yeah, just for safety, just drop it. For now, for now, for safety, just drop them way back. Okay, I'll back up. But don't worry, Chris. This is a. I am a very lenient moderator. Yeah. Like it might. Uh, well, I know Cash is because for uptime's sake, like tanks behind, being behind melee, they're at max melee range. But just for safety, yeah, um, yeah, just from what I've seen, like it, check. Hmm? I but like it, it's gonna follow him. So like, if he moves back, it's gonna inch closer to him. Since he's yeah, but uh, when we're yeah, moving but, forward, uh, it yeah, does... that's true. It will it will follow Cash uh, if Cash moves farther back. But then, after we drop our circles, or if we act them, fast, them, come back in, we'll be able to walk forward and act fast. Excuse me. I've You're I've literally said that before. Still in max melee range, even if the boss ah, does. Thank you for the food. Cash, um, X's position in front of you should still be uh, within the range from there. Uh, n no, X is being the melee on our side. Oh, okay. Right, because Ix is taking the melee position on our side. That position should still be in range, even if the boss moves. I'm inside the boss with my camera right I forgot now. forgot to start a fire! Oh no. Okay. Right. We just want to play it safe for now because, uh, just like with Eric, the, the DPS check on this is really light. Um, we just have to get past the last couple of mechanics. Lag makes me sad. Thank you for the three dollars and thirty-three cent tip. Hopefully, you're not experiencing any of that on the stream right now. Whew. 
Thank you very much. Oh, Chris, uh, Steph is watching TV right now, so Steph Cam would be a copywritten TV show, and I'm not I'm not that much of a Twitch streamer to just show TV shows. Not yet. Someday. I'll get now. Second net. Right, and we'll just play safe with the circles. Drop the circles all the way back in the wall. Uh, we do not need to rotate. Right, so we're going to spread to our left. And then back up after the spread. Oh, fuck! It's okay, it's not nav. Uh, back up, so the stack should still be okay. No, they they left themselves no room. I got nap. Uh, healer LB. Sure. And then uh, get to two with me. What's your animation is? It's pretty long. No. Yeah, still still in it. Hey. All right, I'm good. Uh. Oh no! Claw 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 claw. Dang it. Oh yeah, that makes sense. Didn't really, didn't really matter. 
My my tower was C that time, right? Just making sure I understand that tower. Uh, yeah, the melee. Wait. Yeah, uh, melee would be C, and it's left before right, so C D B. Okay. And then I do understand it correctly. Good. Yeah. Yeah, from where, it's where you start, otherwise left, otherwise right. So melee would be C, then D, then B. Tanks would be the same thing, but they're... You're close to beating Heaven's Word? Ooh. Okay, I'm just uh, reminding myself, making sure that's correct. I think that's right. That's how I understood it anyway. I just mm. want to double check. Well, I'm still ready. So I know we're not using debuff based mitigation, are we getting like Dark Missionary or, or uh, I can forget Divine I Veil, forget stuff that. like that? I keep forgetting that the uh, Gideon is there. What? Yeah. Cause oh, see, it happens half the time because I don't have the right. near me, so you guys have to let me know. Right, one, two, uh, starting at four. Again, to the right stay. Yes. 
I said fuck. Like we fucked up. Dude, I thought the same thing. <laughs> uh, front? Front first. Front for one hit. Front for one hit. And there goes oh. Oh, um, I don't know what I did there, but it was the wrong thing. Yep. Alright. Okay, easy pattern again. I'm all about Chrono Cross music. Hit four and then go across. Go. Stay at three and find your marker. Go. Party stacks again. Don't worry about damage or uptime or anything like that. We're fine. Let's see the rest of the fight. So, second net. And just disengage as soon as We are rotating clockwise. Spread to the left, then back to the wall, and then forward again. Back up. Oh, I wasn't far enough. Can I? Oh no, Nav came with you. Nav, you don't uh, need to move at all be? when the uh, yeah healer LB. You don't need to move at all when the uh, topaz is exploding. Pick over here at C. We got a l couple of lively. We got three uh, lively babes. We got four. We got four. Yeah. Yeah, you're definitely not gonna kill them. So. <laughs> yeah, I don't know that healer LB can't even get us through that. No. Because of the the follow-up yeah, mechanic. Have to, we, yeah, you we, have to you get have into the to... towers. You have to do it instantly and <laughs> up early enough that we can get into the towers. Okay, we'll I'll try to have more of a hair trigger then. Yeah, if, if anything, uh, well, we do need to at least wait for the um, stacks to drop because we don't know, we don't want people getting killed by the stacks and then missing the, the raise. But if either healer survives the stacks, then just use it immediately. You can um, tank LB the uh, all the ads, right? Yeah, if we yeah, if we had the tank. Historic, you're correct. That is the. But we're trying to avoid them spawning. Holy shit, piss video. If we get the healer LB off quick enough. It is in media tech. Have time to well, no, I mean, like, which is like my randomized media project. Just like a healer and a couple people up, just wait until they they're about to fall and use the tank LB. Could do that. Could do that, but you. Uh, the tanks wouldn't want to soak the, the hits from the towers failing, because the hits from the towers failing is going to kill more people. I mean, I think it'd be it'd be best to get people up right, like, immediately after the stacks, and then they can reach the towers in time. And yeah, yeah, that's fine. Then just... nothing falls. Yeah, because it's just that the towers failing, even before the ads explode, the towers failing is going to hit people with tank buster AOVs. So, you're going to... A few more people are going to drop in the process. But if we reach that point and the LB hasn't been spent yet, then yeah. 
uh, tank LB3 is 80% reduction, so it should still get you through all those explosions. Maybe. I don't right. think they apply bones. I think they apply damage downs. So you should. I actually had pizza queued up, slow motion pizza queued up to go into media tech before it even came up on stream. So now it's a slam dunk, right? All right, this is the one, guys. This is it. and I will take the four. Stick where it be this time. Yeah, you're here. Step in. You made it no. first. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> I'm like... All the way in right mode. Starting in four. And then three. And two. So right, right. I got Vic. I thought I was through. My angle was bad that I was looking at. Oh, X! What did I do? Uh, you did you stand on the, the tank? I got X. Yeah, you went did I stand the on the tank? But... Yeah, you stand yeah. on the tank. Oh, boy. Yeah. Sorry about you, that. You... That was complete, like, just staring at... Spread? No, you went... Yeah, you went boss relative, but the boss was facing south. Okay. Good. Hi. I've almost got Swift. C. C for melee. Across. Okay, find your positions. Cash, you're taking C. No. Oh, fuck. Oh, boy. No, no, I got C. Oh, I can get C. 
Tech Cloud? Yeah, but I wasn't expecting anybody else to die. Oh, gotta be. No, uh, as he called uh, find your position, I thought it was just time to go to the position, so I went a little too early. I was told to go to C. I went to C. You were fine. Yeah. No, fine. no I say that because um, a lot of time people are still like really. Anyway, when I uh, when I was parking this, like a lot of times people would still be paying really close attention to the to the jumps, and then when it came time to go to the towers, like they got lost because they didn't know where their tower was. Yeah. So I'm saying like once we're safe from the jumps, uh, we're safe from them. We don't have to move from there, and then you can uh, like reorient yourself, right? Figure out where you are in the arena and where your marker is, and that, that's why I'm saying that so that everybody knows exactly where they're going as soon as that last jump lands but, but yeah no it was uh it was chaotic anyway because we had a death there so everybody was thrown off it's all good in chat who have been submitting songs this time and some pleasant tunes this time around. I appreciate it. Yeah, let me grass. I didn't even know that you could submit music to it until someone in chat told me, so don't feel bad. Depending on the movement, he might all, not always, or I'll, also depending on how long it takes Cash to get back to the A marker. Once he starts casting, he freezes in place. Uh, spread flux box first.
Yeah, I think if we finish... Uh, oh, uh, fronts? Front for one better. Sometimes if we finish south, he begins the cast of the that turns him around. That's why. Alright, easy pattern again. Wait until he hits one. And then across. And we're gonna stay there for a bit. Go. Stay at four. Stay at four and find your mark. Here we go when he hits three. Southwest. again. Uh, the space, the space that we use to uh, be safe from Topaz, it doesn't get fully covered. Uh, second uh, that space doesn't get completely covered by the poison, so healers can stay on that side of the wall. You, you don't even have to cross the wall. Alright, so we're not, uh, we're not rotating. Deep in the crack. Right, so they're both going <laughs> to be threes. Just heal. Uh, can we res? I got it. I got X. I'm on B. I didn't make it in time. Uh, front, front for one hit. Yeah. I would tank LB. I'll just do it. There we go. I'm one casting on Naf. Oh, I'm casting on... No. Okay. Sorry about that. No, no worries. I'll cast on Vic. Ah, oh, shit. Uh, no, nah. that, with all the other stuff going on, I mean... Yeah. The, um, tank swap. Tank swap. Yeah, that's fine. I don't think we've been really past this, so... Okay, first mid again. First mid. I think we have been past this at least once. Oh. This is gonna be that um, the crystal conversion again, and we're gonna go to four. We're gonna go to four, and the melee group will be in the center of the wall. And I'll go join them. Oh, am I a melee group for that? Sometimes I'm not a melee. No, no, no. It's the same split as before. Okay, this is a double dash. Get behind him. Stay behind him and then pop the engine out back again. And it's gonna be that same dash. Uh, no, you're not. Um, yep. But both of the people that were down are normally in the melee group, what? so. Inbound, inbound, inbound. Ah, fuck, did you get it? Okay. Yep. <laughs> I, I ended up casting on nope. Vic because I wasn't sure if a healer was getting cash. Oh, we don't have uh, um... it now. Just start casting on H Rod. I got cash. Okay, and oh, then this no. is the this is the spread and then stack, same as same as it is before devour. People up. Oh, I see. It's the it's, same as yeah. before devour. <laughs> he just does it again. Yeah. 
Jeez, Stumbly. Of, so we were pretty close. Instead of doing Devour again after that, he would have started the Enrage. Oh, okay. And it's it's actually it's a soft Enrage. It's not like a hard Enrage cast where, oh, when he's done with that, he just starts the Enrage cast. Uh, he spams... He has like a unique move at the end that is uh, repeated uh, raid wide damage spam. Turn, um, turn two. Behemoth. ADS. Uh, the old, maybe? Oh, the old way. That's, the old that's way. a heck of a callback. That's, that's really <laughs> old. You're, you're speaking ancient old. languages. I'm thinking like Tamaris <laughs> and Titan. Some linear uh, B going on here. But no, he, you're he dating does, yourself he, there, old man. He like. Somebody else spells. basically um, the uh, like <laughs> oh. Sonic Hell. He he does like three Sonic Hells in a row, and then he does the Enrage after that. So we were like forty seconds off from seeing it. Yeah, the time. stuff after that is is not bad. Um, it's just that we were in recovery mode for the entire thing. Yeah, but we got it this time, Vic and Naf and who's on the, my other side? <laughs> Ella. One of the short ones. <laughs> one, of the sh one of the short ones. Also, we haven't had any reprimands today, so that's good. No, don't remind him. We must be getting better. No, he just forgot him. <laughs> I got a lot to remember now. A lot on your mind? Yeah. I think he's being nice because he was being punk earlier. <laughs> No, is that why you? That's not why you gave me that that Santa hat. I just wanted to get you the Santa hat. Sure. I like the hat. Thank you. I don't see anybody else wearing it. Uh, you literally look at me. I'm wearing it. Uh, two, two. I can't. I can't. I'm currently oh, no, not. I stepped in the and I'm a big gum. I'm sorry. That's all right. I would have done it too if it were in my way at all. Was able to give a hat to, I gave a hat to. Like a Thank you, X. Wait, substream. Oh, oh, means you have a substream active. Okay. I saw the substream icon and I was like, what the heck is that? Why, is there, why do you have a picture <laughs> of Gerudo? Means see. Things to summon people. Step in. No, for a second I thought, like, I thought maybe it was the Phoenix heal, and I was like, oh, hey, that's that's nice, uh, extra heal over time on you. And then I was like, wait, why would the Phoenix heal have a Gerudo? Oh, there's a Ah! How'd you do that? Now there's dead H rod. I have got eight eight I got cash. What the fuck? Yeah, that was like a step too close. Just provoke it when you get up. I got uh, mana ward up. Well, got the right now. there it is. Alright. Uh... Anyway, alpha. Uh, start behind it. And anti knockback. Crossover. Monkey, it didn't do any more autos after that. Second minute. Oh, yeah. Your tiny potato ass. Thank you. <laughs> You're close to A. You're about to be a mashed potato. <laughs> hey. It takes me a while to get moving. Like a baked potato? 
Stacks first. Stacks first. before we go back to four. And black. Okay, Ella got hit. So I went the wrong Delta way. The map got hit. Oh my god. I'm sorry. Cool. I went on the outside. Like a I dog. charged outside of the map. He spit me out! <laughs> oh no, Vic. <laughs> I, uh, I hit my sprint like a split second too late. So I was moving a little slower than normal. Sorry, folks. One of you these days. A, you went from a slimed <laughs> potato to a licked potato to a <laughs> potato. Air potato. <laughs> That's just the way the carbuncles. Potato pancake. Isn't that how you make vodka? Yeah. Hey. Fermented. A little bit of distilled <laughs> potato. Fermented potato. I mean, if he if he chews on you and spits you out, that considered. Works for me. What's a, what's a potato covered in poisonous bile? Mm. Potato that's just been left it's in the drawer too long. A digested potato. <laughs> That's regurgitated nice potato. potato. Regurgitato? A regurgitated potato. potato. There it is. We got it, everybody. <laughs> Three. likes to live on the edge of the poison puddle. I must have fat fingered uh, it earlier. If you guys don't, if you guys don't have your anti knockback, no, I had it. I, I think I thought I hit it, and it didn't hit it. Just, like, I think I fucked okay, it up. Reset. Yeah. No, like, they, they weren't. They the weren't aware. Is, yeah, they weren't aware that they didn't happen. have it. Mine was on cooldown. I I must have, no, mine wasn't. It just, it, it just didn't happen for some reason. Yeah, I everybody didn't knows. No, everybody knows. It. It's possible to survive the knockback. You just have to be closer to the, the line he's dashing on. Yeah. Yeah, if I'd been aware that it didn't work, I would have figured that out. Play it up, bitches.
Jeff has the sound turned up a little bit. Oh. They go with Jeff? No. It's just his speakers are like right next to him. What are you telling? It was super low. We can still hear it echoing. Hey, <clears throat> something. My, micro yeah. my microphone is not going off at all. No, I'm talking about Ellis. I'm on the other side of the brick. I don't think my side is turned up too far. I have a second man. Yeah. That's Sorry, okay. am I? No, it's okay. Is it dealing with a computer oh, pop up? Gonna restart in 10 minutes? No. Hmm? Yes. I'm just making right now. Shame. I'll reprimand <laughs> We've had a couple of Step food in. reminders. Just saying. If you do anti knock back it, you have to move back to the poison. We still got, we still got the other one. Front, front for one hit. Awesome sauce. I am on Leviathan, which is on the primal data center. 
You can go over the next stage now. Away from us. You do, yeah, you don't you don't have to run back through. You, you can always pull them out if we're on the safe side. That's fine. All right, so it's gonna get recentered, and then my party spreads. So I'll try to uh, second mid, second mid, and just one hundred percent respect to the cannon. Don't worry about your damage. Really spread when it's trying to spread. Uh, we're not rotating. And then make sure you drop those circles away from the boss. Yeah, healers are staying, but... Go. Back up. Why did I die? I don't know. What? I got a damage down. Uh, just a normal good. res. No. Yeah, maybe. Normal, just normal res. Right. I was uh, trying to heal. X, you're on Delta. Oh, whoops. Wait, where should I be? Uh, oh, crap. I'll... Sorry. Oh, we um, not make it. What? Yeah, I should have been on two. I'm sorry. I have Vic. No. Ah. Also, because I didn't see what was going on. Nice. Oh, okay. Two baits up though. What the fuck? Yeah, there was there was because two baits up. Ads. <laughs> yeah. No, that was partly my bad too. I mean, the other group. Um, yeah, Nafanol should have been on too. <laughs> I saw you guys there. Would have would have clued me in that I was wrong about that. It's a raid live. Crap. Uh, I didn't get it in time. Damn. I tried. <laughs> yeah. It was an attempt. Uh, well, this would be. Oh, you've been playing since 1.0? Damn, okay. Oh, thank you, Awesome Sauce. It's very kind of you. Yeah, I just, I'm just playing a lot of video games on Twitch. Been doing various other stuff. Bruce and I started a gaming news channel. So, uh, yeah, just making content. Let me see if I can try and figure out. Growing day by day. Yeah, I'm really I enjoying the work. I got a down, but I wasn't sure what I did to get it. I, I didn't see a toxicosis, so I don't think I stepped in poison. Oh, you you stepped into you stepped into the quadrant that was exploding. Oh, did I get like in there? The early? last, just a little bit too Ow. soon. <laughs> you got in there just a little bit too soon on like probably the last tick that it was active. Because those, yeah, it's dumb. It is dumb because it doesn't quite look like it, but those, uh... Noted. When the sections explode, it's it's a persistent AoE for a little bit. Oh. Are we resetting, uh, I guess? We're resetting the timer. Well, I got ten minutes. Okay. Um, use a bathroom so, real quick. break time. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah bio break. Party time. Maybe. But then after that... Oh, okay. So I headed over... Um... I see Craig in here and there. I wouldn't say that we, we talk constantly, but I do enjoy catching up with him, with him whenever I get the chance. And we, we find each other in same the same places three. occasionally. Okay, I'm just gonna turn my cam off and go use the restroom. And I'm gonna get a, I'm gonna get a fire going back here. A nice, roasty, flickery, cozy fire. I'll be right back. If we were going to, if we were gonna adjust that, then Ella should come over me. Oh, Ella was like halfway. She was like in between. Um, but no, that was, that was me, because with the, uh, you know, having a person die, you know, I wasn't sure if we were going to survive the stack, and then yeah. saying to, to, you know, get her back up and make sure that, make sure Ix knows, uh, where she needs to be when she reses, because that's going to be disorienting and all that. Um, what happened was I stopped thinking about the strat and I autopiloted, and I autopiloted doing the other strat, which is... The one that my other groups do so like what i'm used to that's what i'm having problems with like with this group and the other group doing the same fight i'm actually the opposite mm. and mm. 
Like, I do the opposite of what I'm doing in this fight. Yeah. But it's fine. We, we could, I, maybe I feel maybe like I can do it. Maybe we can uh, change it if you want to change. No, no, I don't want anybody to. Everybody's getting comfortable with what they're doing now. No, I don't want to in, push in that up. Force. In the other force, perhaps. I'm in the other in the other group. I'm number two. Okay. okay but so yeah. So just, the thing is, is like cloud. the thing is, like you said, that the grouping in number one is going to help us for four, and I don't want to change that. Well, the getting used to. The reason I wanted to teach the, the priority system on Fort 1 is because we're going to use the same priority system for a more complicated mechanic in Fort yeah. 4. I just it started 4. Already... Yeah, it, it would oh. for Snake phase, basically. So snake oh. phase on 4? Yeah, fuck that shit. Uh, yeah, if you do that, you use like the same priority system you use for the towers, uh, or on this one for the puddles. Uh, to figure out which pedal you get, you do the same thing on snakes to figure out which snake you're dealing with. Uh, it's one about like petrifying the snake and all that stuff, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. That's fuck that. But like to figure I'll... out to figure out which person is doing which snake, it's the same sort of system. So okay. It, it's it, I figured rather than just winging it or whatever, um, if everybody understands uh, like a priority system like this of uh, you know, then you can go things... back to and like fall, fall mm -hmm. into that you already know. Makes it more yeah. comfortable. Because these things are going to pop up in random places, and you have to, you have to very quickly like figure out which one is yours and which one belongs to the other group of people. Um, and we're going to need that for Snake, so that's what we're getting used to. So, uh, so uh, we actually decided to go ahead, and go in. And only two people have tried the, the fourth fight. Mm -hmm. And we all went into it and we went at it for about two hours without watching or reading any strats. Just to see how we did as a group. We got to the we got to the snake face uh, multiple times. Uh, but we couldn't get past. Uh, that point. So, matter of fact, actually, what we kept killing us was the part where he's doing. You have to count. Yeah, the centaur. Yeah. Whatever you, you want to call it. The yes. Phase. Yes. Oh, uh, like that. There's so much damage going out. Mm -hmm. It's ridiculous. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, in my group, we have we have second mitt handling the stomps on centaur and like a bunch of tank and healer mitigation uh, for that as well yeah it's it's ridiculous and it's, yeah, and it's and still it's, and it's still it's a lot <laughs> um so with that fight in general is the probably the hardest like door boss that they've uh, made so far Thanks, guys. Um, uh, I'm gonna put that link. Wait, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna put it in. Santa hat? Santa hat. It's not even December yet, you monster. Oh, wow. Alright, uh, what's it? I have to go. After Thanksgiving, as far as Thanksgiving. <laughs> I'm I'm just giving you shit. I already have a tree up. Is this is the is the hat viable or is there yes. also yes it is viable? Yes. 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 Uh, I am hearing my voice going back through now. Yep. Uh, 
from the mic, so I'm guessing it's being picked up from the mic. So I'm guessing. Oh god, I can't stand it. <laughs> Okay, I'm back. Hey. Okay, I'm back. Hey. <laughs> no. Ooh. Make it stop. Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> yes. <laughs> All right, I tried to give Dick a hat. He did not take it. So all I think is left now. Oh god, somebody There's some there's somebody that has a uh, lot on the Discord. I got him. Here, oh wait, no wait, hold on, hold on. Server mute, yeah. This server mute for a bit. <laughs> oh, is he gone? I think yeah, he would have yeah. Oh, okay. Alright. I guess he's trying to give him the hat also. Someone should have started the beatboxing. <laughs> not me, I'm not good at it. No, I'm not good at it either. Oh, awesome sauce. Thanks for the sub. Appreciate that. Enjoy your ad free viewing. All right. I'm going to go check in with my always hardworking squadron. Sorry, I did that. I did that on purpose so that way my so right now my headset. If I put it on, if I put it on mute, it won't come back, and I won't be able to speak in the. I won't be able to speak anymore. Oh, thank you, sir. That's not good. Yeah, I need to get myself a new microphone. I think I'm gonna Is try it? out uh, microphone. And just headphones combo instead of a headset. Is it a USB headset? Uh, no, it's a, it's a wireless. Oh, okay, well, so yeah, it's something. So it, it has yeah. it has to do with the software. The uh, mm -hmm. what is that? Oh my god, what is it? it Says with a G. Um, yeah, you're talking about like a Logitech. Yeah, there we go. Headset? So what happens is if two uh, if two um, if two apps or applications use uh, try to use a mic at the same time, it fucks up with the whole entire system and it won't go back. Like you can't use it as a microphone anymore. No, I <laughs> what? Have a, uh, yeah, audio, audio drivers can be real bad. Like... I was gonna say I use both. I use the same mic for Discord and while I'm pl talking in like Battlefield games at the same time. No what problems. Kinda, and I have G-Hub. Do you? Well, yeah, maybe I'm running G-Hub with a Yeti mic. Yeah. Oh, well, that's different. Oh, yeah, actual, that's different. But the I'm mic using a, isn't a Logitech. Yeah, I'm no, using yeah, a Logitech. No, no, no. Yeti is owned by Logitech. It's a Logitech microphone. It's in G-Hub. Well, I don't, yeah. Does it use the same firmware as the 933? I don't know about, it's going to use different software, but it's still a Logitech product that's in, and I'm running the well, same it's software. A, it's a software problem with the 933. Because I had the same exact uh, headset before, and I've always had the same problem. Like, I've used the 933 for, like, the last eight years, or nine, uh, seven years. I gave Nap a hat. That I'm not going to be able to use? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> he gets for having a bunny ear. Wait, was that a bot That's under the map? Right. Did you see something? Uh, uh, one second. I didn't see anything. Almost. 
I just need to update my audio drivers because I get... This new motherboard I got is really buzzy. There's just a buzz on all the motherboard ports. Kind of bummer. <clears throat> yeah, I'm ready. The bees. That Bzz. should not be a problem these days at all. I, right? Weird. It super is, though. It's never gone away. That was like a problem from in the 90s and early 2000s on motherboards and then literally got abolished. No, no, I've, I've, it's never gone away for me. It could be an issue with the port going into it. Hmm. I, I had the exact same audio set up yourself, with a different uh, motherboard. I'd get yourself a USB mix amp is what I'd do. Yeah, that's, that is the, the quote unquote solution. But or my, separate sound card. my, audio, oh God. Yeah, there's that too. But my, uh, my audio setup is, is a little complicated. Because of streaming and whatnot. Anyway. How complicated? What are, you, are you running? What is it? Uh, oh, no. Software. Oh, dear, no. No, I'm no software. No, 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 no. Audio software is the worst. You're probably thinking of yeah, voice meter? One... Yes, voice meter. Yeah. Well, mix amp. Yeah. I basically have a, a really junky mix amp. Yeah. Are you all ready? Yeah. yeah. Maybe. But, like, I think, I think Creative has a pretty cheap one, too. I've looked. I'm just scared. I have so many buttons and switches to flip already, just to get everything going. I think one more box with knobs on it. My my brain freaks out. Uh, <laughs> yeah. No. Hey, Trad, you ready? Yeah, know. for now, just keeping it simple. It's just... Like, my whole setup is just an XLR mic into, uh, into like, a fairly small, straightforward little uh, USB amp, and then... Uh, I'm running NVIDIA broadcast so that you, or you don't hear like everything going on <laughs> in my house. It's the thing they used to call uh, RTX voice. Yeah. NVIDIA broadcast that now, and it that actually really well. messed up my that messed up my sound settings. Um, I had to uninstall it because whenever if Discord was set to use my Yeti directly, uh, it would take me 30 seconds to join any Discord channel. Here. Yeah. It was so weird. But no, I have I have both Discord and the stream going through broadcasts just because the mic is like way too sensitive. So I couldn't like anything that happens in this room or the next room outside, you'd be able to hear it if it wasn't for the uh, sound filtering. I would recommend getting that. It's on sale right now, too. Like a Cyber Monday sale. But what's great, because it, it's like looking for and it distinguishes voice and stuff, is that when my girlfriend talks, even though she's on the other side of the room, it picks it up like very clearly. And when we're, when like I'm in Discord with the rest of our raid group or something and she has herself muted, everybody else can hear her more clearly than I can. Because hmm. They're hearing her through the mic and I have the headphones on and she could, this mic is so sensitive that uh, they can hear her when I can't. Which one are you using? Uh, it's it's some electro voice, but I bought it I bought it like back in like 2012, and it's still working. Huh. It was really nice for the time, and it still works. It's a I don't know the exact model, but it's an electro voice uh, cardioid mic. Just got superhuman hearing, huh? Mm-hmm. Right. Oh. Well, it's the it's the cardio part. So like anything like 180 degrees in front of it, it picks it up. I had a mic like that, and then like my uploads to YouTube started getting dinged because of movies Stephanie was watching in the other room. <laughs> yeah. It would pick up the audio and then match to it. No. No, if you're gonna get into if you're gonna get into this thing or whatever, like if I'd known back back then you need to get a shotgun mic mm -hmm. you get anything but a shotgun mic and it's just gonna pick up everything around you i've actually that's actually been a good thing if i ever do group streams because it can be really difficult to mic everybody and then god if you get bleed over from one person into other people's mics it's just terrible so even though it's echoey one nice wide mic can sometimes be better exactly if you're recording more than one person you want a quarter but if if I'm trying to like do a stream thing and I have like my girlfriend's on the other side of the room and she's <laughs> having like a phone conversation, it's like, oh shit, I have to yeah. figure out how to deal with this. 
Who just ran through the poison? Oh dear. No one did. No one. Oh, we're good. Oh, maybe it was just my screen. Cash is just not using mitts. And that doesn't have him cardio on him. <laughs> You're gonna get scolded. So it wasn't that I wasn't using mitts, it was that you weren't healing me. No. It was both. <laughs> it was kind of both. <laughs> I need to say bump mitts. Can't uh, mid everything. Me paranoid. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just gonna worry about both. <laughs> <laughs> He's looking at me like I'm delicious. Backs first. Like when the, they got those trucks on backwards, you're driving down the road. Oh, okay, that was twice. Oh. That was twice I almost messed that up. <laughs> almost went too early and then I went to A. <laughs> Alright. First mid. And it's gonna be the uh, crystal sentence. This is the pattern where Rod will come out. Oh! What the fuck? I got it. Yeah, I guess I, guess I was platform. maybe on the edge. I mean, I thought I was okay. Yeah, you touched the edge of the platform. <laughs> you 
I didn't even see myself in the poison until I fell over dead. Oh, well, because I don't think you touched the puddle, I think you touched the edge. So it was instant death. Second death? Edge of what? The edge you went off the, the edge of the You pulled a catch. Off the edge of the no, that's that's what I'm saying, yeah. Uh, I didn't even see that I was in it until I fell over dead when I fell gotcha, into it. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. <laughs> So light party sides, we are not rotating. Okay, just focus on surviving. Go too early. Spread. Stay. Back. Back up. Back up. And then go back in. Just, uh, remain stacked. Okay. All right, go to your towers. Regular towers, just like at the start. And I will be on three, and I should be on Delta. Step in. in. Uh, front first. Uh, come to the front with me. One hit. So we're gonna have a take swap here soon, so watch out for me. Okay. <laughs> Avoid cash. I'm at one, so I don't come to me. Yep. thing we should have is the quadrant crystals. So next pass should be a ruby glow for first mint. Yep. Alright, I'm just gonna call out where we're going and it's the same rules as the other crystals. Uh, the ranged group will be in the corner and the melee group with map uh, will be in the middle of the map. And we're going to one. Go to one. Range group in the corner. Am I ranged map. this? No. Yes. Yes. Uh, yes. Yes. X X is. We're... I have a confusing thing. You do. Uh, because because X is fake melee. Go behind the boss. Go behind the boss. Anti knockback and put some uh, shields up. Okay. Hey, that felt. Oh. Who's got an aggro? I got. It. Yeah, for the, the crystal stacks, Ix would be considered range since we have a Yeah, fake don't listen melee. to me, Ix, I don't Yeah. <laughs> well, since we have a fake melee, it means it means both tanks can can get up time. Instead of one having to sacrifice up time. Alright, uh stacks. Uh B and D stacks. This is the same as before Devour. So go in. And then box box. Oh. Sorry, Rod. Front. Front for one hit. And switch. Let me know when to LB. Uh, whenever. Okay. Whenever it's good. Whenever it's good for your rotation. Oh, shit. Tank swap again. Oh, shit. I may have. Holy uh... shit! Uh... So the last thing he's gonna do, it's gonna be a new spell name. It's just raid white spam. Submit. Yep. Uh, it's gonna be a new spell name. Sonic Shatter. This is just uh, spamming raid white damage. He's almost dead. It's not even that strong. Yeah, it's not even that strong. It's just a bunch of Sonic tiles in a row. Yay, we got him. Wait, oh, there we go. Yeah. Mm, 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 mm. Nice. yeah. But we only get one piece of loot, guys. It's all an asshole. What? <laughs> He's going to work on his right. alt this week. It's bad. It's... Oh, look, it's Eric. Uh, nice. I want to say two nights. That's all it took us, guys. Two nights. We're good. Proud. Yeah. Nice. yeah. Yes. It definitely. Oh, that's right. Crystallized. A lot harder than Eric. <laughs> I like it more though. Yeah, that was fun. Oh, yeah. Oh, this is my favorite first floor since like Heavensward. Actually, I think. I mean, I like it a lot more than any of the first floors that were in Shadowbringers, and maybe it's close to as good as um, as Chaos, which was the first floor of uh, the last year of Omega. 
Oh, Time for screenshots. <laughs> right, loot on. It beats everything else. <laughs> Remove the. Oh, yeah. Don't loot the yet. Don't loot. Remove the marker. Oh. Uh, I'll clear the world. I'll, I'll get rid of Gerudo too. Uh, what are we doing? Uh, I'm gonna stand on this side of the box. Yeah, I know, I'm just trying to figure out what to do. And... Oh, come on. Uh, that, uh, that's not good. That's not good. I'll use the code. What's the name of the command again? G pose. Oh, it is G pose. Okay. Everybody's here. Tested, except for Dick <laughs> and uh, Bunny Boy. Giant chest. Wait. So. Okay, I thought I thought Dre for a second was a bony boy. No, just you. <laughs> just you. <laughs> oh my god. So Cash, Cash's last animation was an attack. So G pose, I just have him doing it. Oh my god. Doing? Yeah, your your head is definitely in Naf's crotch. <laughs> <laughs> what attack is it that I was doing Best last? Best screenshot ever. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. Salt and darkness, uh, where I like hit the ground. No, it's, it was like the upward slash one. Nice tights, Cash. Thank you. <laughs> I'm very festive. You are <laughs> always. It's in my uh, elven blood to be festive during the season. Is it? Yep. See? Santa, you gave my sword. Because it's a man belt, huh? This is from he's Santa. That doesn't look like a Manderville sword. I mean, it, it actually looks really cool, though. I like how it gets, like, filled in. Like oh, yeah, that's, sword. that's the only reason I'm now a Dark Knight. <laughs> for the really <laughs> sweet weapon. Yes. <laughs> I mean, the paladin, I think, weapon is also pretty sweet. The, the I like how the shield does the same thing. thing. Yeah. Oh man, this animation is so quick. I'm like trying to pause it on the right frame. <laughs> it's hard. This is really hard. Because if I, so if I just take the idle stance though, it looks. Like, uh, like Cash is trying to kill Cloud. Yeah, a little bit. That's fine. <laughs> I kind of like fine. it. That's fine. But also, the only angle that like works in that case is also completely blocking back. Also fine. I, I have yet to hear a uh, valid complaint. <laughs> <laughs> this is really hard. This is like a little tiny. Alright, I, I can uh, do a different emote. Uh, nah, whatever. I mean, everybody else would have as well, so. At this point, so. I got a few good shots. Alright. Yeah, yeah, I got one. I just need oh. to change your pose and that. That's fine. Let's see here. This is like. Gosh, it's like document my games. Final Fantasy XIV yes. A Realm Reborn. <laughs> mm -hmm. I still have my Realm Reborn beta folder. <laughs> I did too until I was cleaning, uh, cleaning house. I've given up on cleaning. You know what? The files ain't hurting nobody. They could just stay there forever. <laughs> then, like a day, I'm feeling wistful. I can just root around on my hard drive and see all these like relics of the past. 
I just I got rid of like uh, six hard drives, but I kept everything on them and put them on one solid day hard drive. What did we get? Oh, a necklace. We got one, we got one piece and some two. And no, not not the one piece, just huh. one piece. <laughs> the necklace even. Ooh. Uh, I think your eyes look so cool in this part. My uh, I need augmented lunar envoy, so I'm good here. I'm going on my point five. Okay, I'm gonna see if that's the answer best because Ella has the six ten. Uh, hold on. Side of the me, I've got my, yeah, I've got my, thing. I've got the bis hold up. Uh, it's hold definitely up. not good for Reaper. So, well, it's not bis Reaper. Uh, the aug right? Augmented lunar envoy. Uh, no, abyssos. This is. Okay. There you go. Uh, Didn't make a spreadsheet yet, Dre? Yeah. This <laughs> list. No. It was I, it, it Thanksgiving, Thanksgiving week, I, just, I completely forgot about it because I've been doing so much stuff. You probably didn't expect but, us to get it down this I, quick. Don't lie. No. Okay, we didn't no, either. I, I, I assumed we were clear. Based on where we stopped last week, I did I never expect assumed. it. It's just that um, I just was distracted. Alright, figures all done. Yes. Got some time. Could, uh... Well, at this point, now we oh, gotta we... start learning the second boss. Yep. Yep. And it's time. Crap. <laughs> <laughs> we have to learn new things. What? This is the poison spinning boss, right? Oh, In man, normal. Yeah, oh, yeah, I was trying to remember oh, what God. we were talking about, and it's like, poison spin boss. It has, like, the yeah, poison that, spray and... Right, the normal, the normal mode. Oh, this one's a the, bitch, isn't it? The, you're talking about the normal mode where the boss, uh, the boss rotates around to shoot the poison. Oh, thank you, Foster. The poison on the entire oh. platform at once. What? Oh, no, no, I don't want to go there, guys. I don't want to go there anymore. <laughs> she doesn't have to spin when she can just cover the entire platform with the poison. I'm gonna, we're gonna catch diseases. Don't go in uh, quite yet. Let me go. Fine. Let me go gem this mm -hmm. necklace real Fun quick. <clears throat> Act fast. It sounded like it was Chrono Trigger. I think. Did you see oh, the screenshot? Getting another. Oh yeah, I should. I should also. I gotta. I gotta mine. upload the one where nice. Cash's head is in Naf's butt. How did you get the one with my eyes just red? I don't know. It's so <laughs> cool. <laughs> Like everyone looks all cheerful and happy, and I'm just like, they look evil as fuck. <laughs> I'll kill all the guys. <laughs> and that's uh, riding my sword there. Hey. <laughs> yeah, those are definitely better. I don't do. I don't really do the effects and fancy angles and things. Oh yeah, that one at an angle is really good too. That's something to do with uh, with Cash's animation there. Just have Cash's. He's just he's just going down on he's he's going down yeah. on you, babe. <laughs> just getting his head just right in there. In there. <laughs> Ow. Oh, I'm the only one on that side of the box, like dancing with my set. Uh, uh, uh. Spirited away. Oh, fancy. Nice. They ever explain why there's a giant treasure chest? <laughs> what in the raids? Yeah. No. Ah. Uh, nope. They've literalized so much of like the game mechanics as lore. Yeah, I always love that. Their remaining stuff. 
What was interesting, they did do one fight where the loot was contextualized, and it was the uh, Monster Hunter trial in Stormblood. Huh. Because you collected your loot off uh, Rathlos' body like you would in Monster Hunter. That's awesome. I still haven't done that. It's still in my quest log. Yeah, I haven't done it either. I would it's, like really to good. it's a really like non-standard fight where um, you've seen in 14 like the untankable enemies. Mm -hmm. There's some bosses and stuff that just ignore tank aggro. So Rathos is kind of like that where, at least in the first phase, he'll kind of follow the main tank around. But all of the moves that he does are more like Monster Hunter moves where he'll like do an animation and it's all untelegraphed uh, cleaves and AOEs and, and various... Um, they definitely have shapes, but there's no telegraphs on any of it. And you're just running around, uh, you know, trying to figure out what movie is doing for the animation and writing it. And uh, everybody gets a, uh, a duty action to drink a potion, and it'll just full heal you. In the first phase, it's not that big of a deal, because the healers can just heal. But in the second phase, they disable healing by any means other than those potions. Ah, So you okay. don't have to worry about healing. You get to the second phase, and you're just green DPS now, and everybody has to keep themselves alive. That rules. Yeah, I gotta and, do it 15 uh, more times. I've got, I had to find them, but I got uh, 35 scales from Extreme. So let's go! Let's do them! <laughs> I need 15. But I don't need, like, three others of you. Good. A four-person one. I mean, I didn't... I never finished Wait, farming the this is Bohemian Rhapsody. I mean, so... That's the pain in the butt. God damn it. Oh, I'm staring. And the other thing, um, the normal version is an eight-man trial, but the extreme is... I, I don't four. know if there are any others after <clears throat> Realm Reborn, but it's a four-man extreme. Like it would be in Monster Hunter. Uh, and they even have, rather than uh, timing out, I think there is an instance timer, but they even have the rule that uh, if you die, you can release and get back up and continue fighting, but after three deaths, it fails the pull. Even if, like, the fourth player was still alive, if three players die, it just fails the pull. Or if somebody dies three times screws your yeah over. same thing three deaths total you can't so they just they just put monster hunter in 14 like the same thing when they did uh in the monster hunter half of the crossover this reminds me when they like monster would try to put it's complicated good. musical compositions on like the nes processor and it couldn't quite do the rhythmic syncopation properly so it had to fudge it a little bit and Listening to this bard absolutely tear up Bohemian Rhapsody. Yeah. They're so ridiculous, man. Like how? Bot, not bots, uh, macros uh, and apps. Yeah. Uh, third, third Cheaters, you mean? They cheat. Yes. Cheater at. Third, third party programs. You, you couldn't. Cheaters. You couldn't do that by macro either. They're using. Uh, ah. So I, I know that I don't know what it's called, but um, there is a third-party program. It's not like a plugin or anything. It's an actual program you run to, on the side, and it will convert a MIDI file into inputs, like keyboard inputs. Hmm. And so there's there's like a version for that where it will convert MIDI files into. Uh, the default inputs for performance in 14 and then you just pull out the right instrument and you start playing a midi and it'll make your character play it in the game but now when you see people pulling off like superhuman speeds of playing songs and, like it's, this. <laughs> and it's just perfect and they're hitting every note they're probably using that I'm... Yeah, that is really good, though. <laughs> Just the, the partial clumsiness with the timing makes it more endearing. I don't know. I mean, there's always... 
the possibility. What you could do is you could take a keyboard. Like, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> an actual musical keyboard. And you could plug that into a PC and assign it to, you know, keybinds and actually play the song. That could be what people are doing. Hell yeah. Um, That's the real metaverse right there. Busking and Limsa. I have a feeling that most of the people doing these performances are doing that. Oh yeah, I'm sure it's all like bots, but I don't care. It's still pretty magical. Yeah. Oh, it's still... I, the song choices are still really interesting. <laughs> yeah. And, and their conversions. That, and, and also knowing that they have to be midis for that program to read them means... So, people are still making midis of like modern songs. <laughs> <laughs> just for this because <laughs> I had a whole MIDI collection like back in the early 2000s I had a whole bunch of them that, <laughs> right uh, back when you know an mp3 was well, too big yeah when uh, when an mp3 was a, an afternoon's ordeal to acquire <laughs> <laughs> oh uh, LimeWire you mean <laughs> dial up come on whoa yeah. yeah. LimeWire Napster I mean, that was also so, a thing. Acquire. I've been muted this whole time. <laughs> <laughs> you know. Yes, totally. That's what you meant. Coded off of a legally purchased CD. Le legally, legally purchasing my uh, my legal MP3s of uh, mm -hmm. legally released songs over my legal 56k connection. Yes. <laughs> Yes. The Final Fantasy Police are gonna the streaming police are gonna get you. Like fifty six K was blazing fast. Back in the day. <laughs> There's gonna be a new Metallica album to steal soon. It's pretty exciting. Sweet deal. <laughs> Although I'm like a sad adult now and I pay for streaming services. Right. Thanks, Spotify. Give me my unwrapped. I'm an I'm an extra sad adult, and I actually pay for like discreet purchases rather than streaming. Discreet purchases, huh? Oh, discreet purchases. I don't know exactly, I, I don't know exactly <laughs> what you would call them, but like what not that streaming, mean? but the actual, you know, on the whatever you buy the actual thing itself instead of a service. Let's see. You know, I'm I'm just old fashioned <laughs> like that. So anyway, here's one. Yeah. <laughs> hmm? Hold on, you don't have the rights the for that. <laughs> Do we want Isn't to anybody sitting next? Yeah, to I'm ready. I think. Do we, we were... want to start some P6 prog, or are we waiting on something? I don't remember. Uh, we were. We were just we were watching this dude. Something. <laughs> were we? I think so. Somebody. I think we were just enjoying some time. music. <laughs> no, somebody's. When we talked about it, when we mentioned it last time, somebody said they were still doing something. I don't know what it was. I too remember nothing. Oh wait, <laughs> turn on music. I guess it's a great music song. Oh boy. <laughs> oh, it's all gooped. Here we go. <laughs> a new fight going in blind well blind six of us oh. I've just summoned seven of my best friends yeah da -da -da -da. probably one of the coolest additions rather than just having everyone be there it's just like pew 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 this chick needs to see a dentist I'm just saying right <laughs> <laughs> I'm oh, sorry, let me don't assume gender. This person needs to see a dentist. Yeah. I, think they, I think they said that it was a lady in the story. Yeah, is it? This, this I don't know if her... she's got tentacles coming out of her ass. Hermione. It's Hermione. Yeah, it's Hermione. <laughs> Hermione. <laughs> she's a wizard. Mm-hmm. Alright. Like, yeah. what? Do you cash? Good job. God damn this. You know it's gonna be a death wall. Why do you do these things? Yeah. You never know. 
So just uh, just, just <laughs> resin and make him make is. him sit out the sickness while we set this shit. All right, let's see. I'm gonna do. So I'm actually not gonna do the markers that I'm used to because this is another case of uh, we got to this fight before like the really good strats were out, and I know of a better strat that I would rather teach you guys. Yeah, then then what we're you know what we stuck with. So markers are gonna be something like that. Um, and do I Yeah that yeah that's pretty good. Okay. I was wondering if I wanted to be alternating letters and numbers, but no I think uh, doing it like this is, is gonna be better. So I can call letters and numbers for certain things. So go ahead and save that. Um, so, yeah, I don't want to write that one. Okay, um, so I would actually ask, because we're going to get to it pretty early on, uh, Nav, what strat does your group do for the numbers, the, the limit cut? Uh, you know, the uh, we just use uh, uh, 8 through 20, you mean? No, not, not Cachexia, the one that's early on. Like the second mechanic, where you get numbered one to eight. You know, she's oh. doing the, the cleaves, the cones. Okay, uh, we use the cardinal uh, and intercardinal. We start on intercardinal uh, to get hit, and then we go to uh, B and D. The way, oh, but B and D, like uh, using it the way. B and D will be up. east and west. Uh, right. to wait okay, for, so uh... you have four different positions. Yes. Yeah, right. Yes. Okay. So like diamond weapon? Exactly. Exactly. Flood ray from diamond weapon. Yeah. That is how I prefer to do it. I'm not sure if these markers would be perfect for that, but we could try it. These markers are for Kukexia. Um, which is going to be like yes, the yeah. devourer of this fight. It's the, it's the big mechanic on this fight. So... All right, we can try that for now. Um, how about instead, because I know east-west uh, is what a lot of people are used to. Should I put the numbers on the north and south instead? So we can have people go to the numbers? Uh, would that make more sense? Oh yeah, Pop-Tart had a rough day. Actually, it might, yeah. But good food and a lot of coffee. People are used to, uh... yeah, let's do that. People are used to standing east and west to be safe. A decent trade-off. Hey Foster, who's your who's your favorite streamer besides me? Good catch. Okay, so like that instead. Okay, uh, update update the remarks because this will uh, be more in line with what now it's already been doing. Oh, oops! Not the I do the wrong way. I'll reload them. There you go. Yeah, save them. Click the, click the arrows. Now, the thing is, though, I feel like these aren't quite right. They're going to hit each other. Jam bread music. Oh, okay. And a music streamer? Or... All right. Well, we'll figure it out as we go. I'll have to Don't see we exactly always? What place. I feel, because the way I have it, feels like, like C and 3 are too close to each other, D and 4 are too close to each other, but I'm not sure exactly where they should be, so... We'll like, uh, normally, the way the way that we have it is just like normal square. Uh, uh, a, north... Know, but it's, it's for a Kekexi strat where people are barely going to have to move. Okay. Uh, is it just a normal splash damage? And pop tart, they already have you doing ten-hour days, yeah, huh? So we can adjust them. Hopefully, you get some fat, fat paychecks for this. It looks okay. Uh. Yeah. We'll adjust them when we get there. They're fairly big. I feel like uh, the two blue markers would hit each other if they're actually on them. But I think, as far as like showing generally where you should go, uh, that's good enough. All right. So. Um, like I said, it's a strat that I haven't personally done. I don't have the marker saved, so we'll just have to adjust it as we go. That's fine. Alright. So, first thing, uh, like any other boss, um, this boss is going to start with a uh, raid wide and a tank buster. 
Um, but the first tank buster is always a cone that is meant to be shared, but it can just be inbound. So we'll just inbound the first one. The second tank buster is always a split. Um, so both tanks will get hit. And the main tank will also get a vuln on them. Uh, I think it's like a physical vuln or something to where you want to swap it. Um, and those two are... Yeah, Foster. So um, the rest of them are random. Bruce and I and still make a gaming news show, actually. Name. Yeah, thank you, so BB number nine. I have a fast name to see what Inside it's Games. Either gonna be a tank That's the big thing we still... And we still stream together quite often. Uh, I'd say once a week, maybe. Swap when it's spread. Um... The, every single raid wide, so as far as first and second mint, the, the raid wides are all spaced out enough that first mint can get all of them. So first mint will just do all of the raid wides. Second mint will do various different things uh, throughout the fight. Yeah, Bruce is awesome. But you can just I'm very lucky to still with, uh, get to do stuff with him. Um, tank busters for now, and then light parties. Hmm? Is there something with standing? in front or behind, like the, the person closest to the tank buster thing? Or am I thinking I of something else? No, I think you're thinking of something else. The the tank buster in this, uh, the, I don't think the front or back matters. Okay. It's just going to be a, a shared cleave, but um, I mean, we'll see. Because like, I haven't tanked it myself, so I just know that there's a stack and a spread, and the spread is a swap. But I don't think the stack applies to Vuln because we just invuln it and there are no consequences. I mean, we don't even swap it. So, um, right. And then after that, you just need to know your light parties. And this fight, do you remember Zodiac, the very first trial that we did? Yeah. I remember all the planets and the rotations and whatnot. Well, that was oh, never mind. Yeah. But no, I do not. Um, no, Zodiac, the very first one was the one where the platform would rotate under us. Ah. Right? Yes. And you remember how on that one I like I marked myself, and for most mechanics, because we could just stack, you could just follow me with the mark. Um, this fight is sort of like that. There's going to be a lot of mechanics. I'm never even going to need to fully explain them, because I can basically just say, hey, follow me. All right. And, uh, <laughs> guide you through them. Oh, uh, Foster, uh, you got added, it's huh? a lot. It's... These tiles that are out, you remember, if you remember in the normal version, um, would, sorry, tiles in, in the middle of learning a new fight, around, then you'd have to figure out, oh, okay, what's going Yeah, I think, I think check and reiterate. That is the gimmick of this fight, except that the tile patterns and swaps are more complicated, and she's layering more complicated mechanics on top while she's doing that. Um, so, it's going to be a lot of like learning different patterns and then identifying right, what square is safe to stand in while I do this other thing. Um, but for now, I can just guide you guys. So I can guide my group on the right side, and I think because Nav already knows this fight. <laughs> <laughs> no, you can't. Uh, you can't guide uh, group one. I mean, it's usually the opposite of you. I'll be standing. Yeah. Okay. No worries, Foster. Wait, I appreciate it. Really Thanks for saying hi. Who, who's what? in that group? Uh, the same groups as the last Same group as before. Okay. Yeah, we'll just keep the same groups as the last fight. Uh, so actually, let's just do let's do regular healer markers, one and two, like that. And I'll be the guide for uh, group two over here. Uh, and then I say uh, we just pull and see, see how far we so... see. Don't we want to? Don't you want to give us like uh, positions to where to stand for certain oh, right. configuration and? Hold on. Can't, Thanks for gifting a sub. Thanks. Right for the uh, the corner mechanics and all that. Yeah. Um. Okay. So I think we had. Okay, we don't want exactly the same groupings. Uh, it's gonna be Wait. cash. No. <laughs> yeah, I'm trying to think of, of another uh, uh, DPS and non DPS pairs. I think on P4 we had we had a few mechanics with DPS non DPS pairs. So Cash and Ella would be uh, red, red corner. Uh, Nath and Vic in purple corner. Um, Rod and me 
in the yellow corner, and X and Cloud in the blue corner. So when we need to go to corners, uh, those are your corners, and you may need to go north and south, like where the numbers are, or east or west, uh, where the letters are. But I'll call that out as we go. It's just important when I call corners, everybody knows uh, it's going to be one DPS and one non-DPS in each corner. Okay. Okay. That is that is a, a good point. We're going to run into that again pretty early. And I say, we just go, see what we see, talk about it, once, once people have seen it, then you'll know what I'm referring to. Start off, like I said, with um, Tank Buster and Raid Wide. I forget which is first, but Synergy is the Buster, and that's what second Nets will get. Uh, Dark Core is the Raid Wide. First Nets will get Dark Core. Right. Uh, this one, you can just inbound it. Yep, inbound. That is mint. So Chelic Synergy is meant to be shared, but you can just take that. Alright, so go to your light party sides, east and west. Same as on the top level. And there's going to be a couple of tiles that pop up. So my group is on the inner tiles, uh, group one is on the outer tiles. You're going to be stacked, and then you're going to move into one of these cones after they hit. Got him now. All right. Uh, I now, everybody has, push, push, push. everybody has a number of pips <laughs> over their head. If your number is less than five, then go to the same marker. Like one to four would go to those markers. If your number is know. five or more, you would go to the east or the west. Okay. Okay. But it's good that we're seeing this. Phoenix math again. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> uh, sort of. Yeah, it's sort of like Phoenix, but not quite the same uh, pattern. In fact, that actually just reminded me why. Oh, it's just Phoenix can. math. Phoenix math. Yeah. <laughs> Seeing numbers. So, JC, thanks, yeah, for yeah, thanks for the prime. Thanks for the sub. Hope you're still around. We can't do the overhead marker thing this time because we need to be able to read what those are. So I think I'll be okay to have it. Um, I can still see mine through it, but we'll take the units off. So. Yeah, you're right. You it, could it put one on me. I, I can see it. Just give him the circle. So if you have five or more, you go to east or west. Um, and is one. it is which um, east or west defined by which light party you're in or what? So uh, Phoenix math is right. Uh, basically, five is going to be with one. Six will be with two. Okay. Seven will be with three. Eight will be right. with four. Got but, it. Um, but it's not going to be like Phoenix, where one and five stack on top of each other, and two and six stack on top of each other, and so on. Um, in this case, five through eight do not want to be hit by the first four, because uh, these volumes will last for the entire mechanic, and the second hit will kill them. Instead, you'll be swapping out. Uh, Vice, thank you very much for the sub. Directly to one, two, three, and four, wait to get hit. And thank you for the GLs. Yeah, we already we already beat five tonight, so. And six and seven will be on the right. Get an early look at six. Got it. Where do we run after that first hit? Uh, well then one through four would run to the safe spots, which are east and west. Safe spot. Okay, okay. Between A and D, or between A and, a and D C. and B and C. Gotcha. Those are the safe spots. So well, that's if, where we should go before we run in. To get there. If you're also. in the upper half, if you're in the upper half, so you're five or higher, you should go to the safe spot first on the side that's like closer to your the number you're gonna fill. And if you're lower, if you're one to four, you just go to one or one to four. And then when one when one gets hit, one and five swap with each other. And then when two gets hit, two and six swap with each other, and so on. So, uh, 
what is going to result in it is the boss is just going to shoot one, two, three, four, and then when, he, when she gets to five, she's just going to shoot one, two, three, four again. So this is um, this is a strat used on one of the later uh, Shadowbringer trials that had a uh, very similar mechanic to this. There's a lot of uh, of different ways you could do it. I've seen groups that just point them all north. I've seen groups that just split them off in two directions and they have all of the odds on one side and all of the evens on the other side, which is what my groups do. But this way, uh, each person only has to move once. I like it. Mm -hmm. Works for me. That very, that very first mechanic as well, uh, where we... What you got, Foster? What's up? Stack, and then she shot the cones and you move into the cones. It doesn't matter which cone you go into, as long as everybody on that side is on the same wavelength. So hey, Crab Foam, how you doing? You're going to go into this one or that one and move together, it's fine. So what I always do is, uh, rather than being right down the middle of the safe spot, I stand on the edge of the cone. Um, yeah, I, I always try to go, go close to the water I'm going to so people know where yeah. we're going. So I, I have some awareness I'm used to going of there. people's jealousy of my hair. I'm very blessed. I acknowledge that. And I try not to take it for granted. I'm going to move north. So we're gonna be but apart from that, I try not to dwell on it because I don't know. What am I, I going to do about it? Aside from have the most fabulous hair that I possibly can. Yep. Yeah, that, yeah. that first one is extremely easy. The only I have a natural gift. No, it's nice. Is uh, which columns are getting hit. Yeah, you're either going to get hit here or here. It's, yeah, it's just which columns are being hit. So we're yeah, either so going to like, be on our side in or out. Just so, like, in case, like, half the light party goes one way and the rest of them go the other way. Well, that's what I mean. Um, we don't want to split like that. So I'm just going to say, at least for us, uh, I'm used to going north. So, like, towards two. Yeah, I'm always so going to move go. north as I mean, well. Okay. Okay. So as long as everybody moves the same way, well, then we'll still be stacked, and it's fine. And that will never have to change. It's just whether you're in or out. Clusters also never change, so the first one is always Chelix, and that could be ones. Although later, um, if we need the other tank to stack, we just call first stack. Alright, so light parties. Go to your corners. I think we're going right into that, right? Yeah. That so go to the corners corner. that we assigned before. We're here. I think I everybody's think. correct. Everybody's correct. All right. So you're going to get a symbol over your head. I'm going to call DPS in or out. DPS are out. DPS go all the way out to the corner and towards the front or back, uh, north or south. Right now. And then you switch over. Oh, no. Oh, and then we should have gone. All of us should have gone. Yeah, it's okay. Cool. Act, right? It looks so, like. I can, uh... That was a lot of death. I'll run into the wall. I'll run into the wall. What happened now? Like, what should we have been doing? 
I'll, I'll show you. All right. So is this that thing first... that Nap posted? Is this Kachexi? No. Oh up. no, we're nowhere near Kachexi. Oh, oh Nap posted like, a whole thing about all kinds of different. <laughs> Yeah, don't 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 look over that. That's just like. I'm curious. I like the fun that has jelly. There's a donut. There's a donut. Yeah, with sprinkles. Yeah. <laughs> look at the jellyfish. Sprinkles. <laughs> don't worry about that. That's so a lot of a lot of that stuff in there are going to be things that I can just call as we go. Hey Jess. Okay. They don't need. Oh to be Chris. By every Doodles are just the start of it. Oh my gosh. So definitely make the diagrams in this game. Be able to find it yourself. But we're also not even at Poly 2 yet, so, um, yeah, so that's in the future. For now, what was going on there is, uh, everybody got a, some kind of symbol over their head, and there's three kinds. Uh, four people are gonna get, like, an orange, uh, kind of a fire marker thing, um, I don't know, uh, I don't know what else that's come up, but whatever. It's a little orange uh, arrow pointing at you with a circle around it. And that means you're going to explode. Big AoE. Um, you want to be away from other people. Three people are going to get a ring. Like a kind of purplish uh, donut ring. And you're going to do a donut AoE with a, a decent sized safe spot in the middle. But otherwise pretty big. If you do run away, Thanks, Foster. You're hit everybody that's not extremely close or extremely far. Uh, the last person is going to get a stack, and it's a four-man stack. So what you want to make is all of the spreads in, are in each corner, and then the stack is in the center with all three of the donuts. And that Ooh, way the spreads are sense. out of range. Yeah, the spreads are out of range of donuts. Donuts are all overlapping their safe spot, and they're with the stack in the middle. The trick is, four of those players are going to be paired with um, tethers that are switching their symbol with another player. So two pairs of two. Uh, there'll be four people with no tether, what they have is real, four people who do have a tether, they're going to swap. But you actually don't need to worry about what your partner has, and it's really not that complicated either. Because, like a lot of other mechanics, this follows certain rules. Uh, the rules are two DPS are always going to get uh, a mechanic that's in. So the donuts and the, the stack are considered in mechanics. Uh, two DPS will always get ones that are in, and two DPS will always get ones that are out. And one of those pairs will have both tethers. So after the tethers swap, all four of the DPS will either have the out mechanic or they'll all have the in mechanic. And it's the same thing for the tanks and healers. The the important thing, all that matters is that after the swap happens, all tanks and healers are either always in or they're always out. And it's the out. I listen to the soundtrack a lot. So all I have to do nights, man. is look at what Good I have. Stuff. And uh, also, right, I skimmed over it, but if you do have a tether, you're always going to be tethered to somebody that has the opposite as you. So if you have the out mechanic, you're always going to be tethered to somebody with the in mechanic. Uh, it's never going to swap you with the same thing. So all I have to do is look at what symbol uh, that I have and whether or not I have a tether to know if it's real or fake. And I know what DPS are doing, and I can call that. And tanks and healers just do the opposite of that. So if I say DPS are out, tanks and healers are in. If I say DPS are in, tanks and healers are out. Everybody knows what they need to do just based off my uh, my symbol alone. So and if you're out, you yep. go to a corner. Mm -hmm. Now, if, if you're you wanna... in, which one do you want? Like which uh, which square do you want us to go to? Center. Just go to the center. Um, you can't go to the center because he's gonna be so... he's gonna be shooting both uh, either. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, but they're they're cones rather than lines, which means I understand that, that but there. So in the center, there's two triangles you can sit on. Mm -hmm. Which one do you want us to go? North or either, south? It doesn't matter. So now you could. I know. I know a lot of other groups. Uh, I, I've seen other groups that assign everybody to go to a particular side, like south or east or whatever, oh. uh, because of the donuts. But if you're close enough to the boss. 
the safe spot on the donuts is fairly big. Um, as long as you're really, like, deep inside the hitbox, it will reach across oh. to the other side. Oh. So, but if we are, oh, if we are going to, uh, say that people can be on whichever side they want, you do have to be really deep in the hitbox so that your donut safe spot reaches That's across. why it's just better to assign to an area so everybody has the same information do, and goes... Uh, we could do, like, south and east, but yeah. it's never really... Uh, I don't know. We, we didn't have uh, many problems with that, but if... Yeah, we do south and east. Uh, how about, or like, the pie division, like, the, when it's the other one? When it's a pie. When it's a pie? I forget the name of the the ability, but the same ability he does at the beginning, he'll do that later on while doing the... where DPS and, and tank have to, you know, figure out where I have to go. Oh, that thing. Okay, roll exchange. Um... Yes. Yeah. Uh, rolling, roll exchange is just going to be uh, stacks on B and D and spreads uh, by one and three. Um, or yeah, yeah, that no, that works. Stacks of B and D. Um, and where we, you actually don't need to send the spreads all the way out to the corner for that. I mean, if they're ranged, sure, there's no harm in it. Uh, but you can get uptime for everyone as long as it's max melee and you're spaced out correctly. Yeah. So, but that's that's later. We'll come to that later. Okay. okay. Anyway, for now, um, like I said, if you want to determine for yourself whether you're in or out, then uh, if you get the fire thing, you're out. And if you get the ring or the stack, you're in. And if you have a tether at all, your tether will always connect you to somebody with the opposite. So just whatever you are, you do the opposite if you have a tether. All right. Once you know whether you're in or out, then the other thing is uh, if you are out, you're going to your assigned corner. And here's the important part. Those cones, uh, before she does them, she will always center herself and face exactly north. So uh, they always perfectly hit the corners of the arena, um, which means literally to dodge them, I can go from this tile that's right here, if she's hitting the sides, and just cross over to this tile if she's hitting the front and back. Um, it'll make more sense if you guys come over to the corner that I'm in. All right. Or, yeah, either mine or Nav's. It doesn't matter. They're all the same. It's all symmetrical. And you look inward, and you see, like, if you go diagonally through these tiles, they just cut through the center of these circles. This is exactly the line that those cones will follow every time. Okay, because she'll teleport center herself and uh, face north. So you just need to be on one side of the circle and then go to the other side of the circle. And that's all you have to move. Uh, to figure out which side, you have to look at her pose. She's either going to hold her hands out to her sides, she's hitting east and west, or she's going to, like, twist. She's going to twist her torso, put her hands out front and back of her, and that means she's hitting those sides. So you just dodge them, and then you move into the other section. No. Um, if she if she's hitting to the side, if she's hitting the uh, east and west, you want to be standing on the south. Yeah, yeah. You look at her pose and like where her arms, where, where her hands are stretched out, and that's what's going to get hit. So you just dodge it. But uh, it is important though if, if melee and tanks you do have to actually go out because the AoEs are very large. So you're not going... If you're out, you're not going to get up time. Alright. Oh, and then, uh, of course, the group that's in is going to be doing the same movement, but you're going to be doing that movement under the boss instead of in the corner. Ben, that's an incredible emote. Thank you.
parties. My group is out. Group one's in. Group over. Okay, numbers are coming up. One through four, go to one through four. Five through eight, be safe. Get ready to swap in. There's a six swaps in, seven swaps in, and eight swaps in. Wait. Oh. oh, six went to. Oh, it's Phoenix Math. Ella? Oh, was it <laughs> my Phoenix bad? Again. Six went to two. Uh, er, I got her. She's coming up. Yeah, six goes to two. Okay, sorry. Uh, go to your corners. Assign corners. Change of agonies. DPS are out. DPS are That's going muted. out. Tanks and healers go in. Side what, is, what does orange Side mean? Oh, that's what orange means. Why? Oh. Oh. Alright, so this is going to hit both tanks. Uh, you both need to mitigate and swap it. No, don't stack on each other. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's okay. Uh, that is that. So, Chelik, Chelik synergy is the cone, and it is meant to be shared. And just regular synergy is an AOE on both tanks. It's it's basically the same as Nearsight or Farsight, except uh, except the range doesn't matter. It's just the top two aggro. Um, and you do both need to mid it. And swap. So I should have oh. gone to two. I was I was six. Six minus six minus four is two. Yeah, I saw three. I'm like, oh, I know this. So I see a three. Three divided by threes. two. Yeah, because <laughs> the, the symbol is a pair Number of threes. Two. I'm thinking, ah, oh, four goes to four, right? Or the eight goes to four because it's divided by. It, it's uh. not. Yeah, because it's not divided by two. <laughs> you're, you're divided by two. You need to subtract four. Yeah, I was like, wait, I was seven. What the fuck? <laughs> but I was muted, so nobody could hear me. <laughs> uh, my bad. That's okay. Yeah, it's just Phoenix yeah. math again. Is it what? So, so my group just points. Uh, we point all of the odds at one and all of the evens at two. Who's up, Eli? So we like swap out for every other hit, which means. I mean, you're still technically only moving twice because you're going into your position and then you're going back out of your position. Um, but it means that the swaps need to be uh, twice as fast as they do with this strat. Nath, you're going to be going to one. You're five. I got Vic. Maybe. Mm, yeah. Vic was one, right? Yeah, why was I not safe in the same spot I was safe last time? Uh, either... Well, uh, Nath might have been off, because he went to the wrong side at the beginning. So maybe the angle is off a little. All right, go to your corners. And DPS are out. Tank healers go in. Front and back are safe. Start in the front and back. And then switch over. Why? Why do I always die to that? Uh, your body for the is same exactly, reason I did. Yeah, your body's exactly on the corner. No. You, I didn't die from the wall. Oh, you I died. I was alive. I died from the AOE. Uh, it maybe we just didn't 
I couldn't figure out where the front and the back was. It all looks the same. So she might not have been tapped off. I'm casting on Ella. Oh, no, we shouldn't have done that. Um, I'm casting on Cash. I got stinky lines. Oh, oh no, there's a stink line. I'm. Oh, oh no, I have a snake coming. Oh yeah, out. parasites. They they okay. make a shoot, right? So you'd go to your uh, corners again, and if you have a snake, you'd want to look away. And if you have a wing, uh, you would want to face forward. I, I Ow. Oh. Although I've seen I've seen a really. You know what? I want to try actually an alternate scrap for that, rather than corners. I'm good, Vic. Come to the center. Everybody stack up in the center, and then we're gonna go towards the red marks. And now, go over to the red corner. Oh, not too far. Yeah, don't not run into far. the. Uh, don't run That's into important the information. Okay, and now it would be uh, tanks and healers in the west, DPS in the east. If you get a stack marker, you are leaving the group. You get a stack uh, marker, you're going out. I don't know what I have. Help. Uh, so Ella, will, Ella had the I stack marker. Ix, Sorry. you had the flare marker. Or spread marker, whatever you want to call it. It's okay, there's a lot of stuff. Oh, Rod, uh, holograms. So you, you can just keep it. But once Raising X. Wears off, uh, for the Thank you. There's gonna be uh, a dot. Yeah, it's already done though. Okay. Uh, I think we're on light party tiles. So okay. I'm casting on Ella. Yeah. Go oh, to your light got me. Sides. Oh, okay. Go to your light party sides. You want to stay on the inner tiles. Be on yellow and purple. Yellow and purple in inside the house. Okay. And now uh, to your corners again. And the ranged and uh, ranged DPS and healers are going out. Tanks and melee will stay in. Ranged DPS and healers go out. And dodge these cones. Front and back is safe. Start front and back. Oh. And then Shit. go across. I can't follow simple instructions. That's, that's my bad. <laughs> no, it's going to take a bit because uh, we haven't had, like, front, back, or side hits in a while. Or well, we had front and back ever... last boss. Do we have... Wait. Does last boss have front and back? I don't think so. Well, he's got claw and tail. You just have to figure out. Oh, no, no, no. What that's, the fuck? No, that's, oh, no. that's completely different. That's front what? four back. Lots this of stuff is... happening. Yeah, this is Pickaxe. Th this is the devourer of this fight. Oh. This is so I'm not, I'm not explaining that. I'm gonna, uh -huh. We're going we're gonna to learn the stuff leading up to that. Makes sense to me. Or okay. how, how, how are you doing? It's uh, 11 of your time. You've been off those. What? 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 Oh no! <laughs> what? How are you doing? He was asking to hurry one time. I can, I can do it in like half hour. Okay. Just okay. double check. Okay. So, um, yeah, last boss had a front or back in the sense of front was safe or back was safe. Um, yeah, Helix, that was jets back. and guns. This is like, you know, uh, I guess, yeah. <laughs> I was gonna make a bow tie thing. This is making an X. I need a quick bathroom either... break. I'll be right back. Okay. Okay. Uh, th this one is making an X where either the top and the bottom are safe, or both of the sides, like the left and the right, are safe. And you're not switching from the front to the back. You're switching from being in the front or the back to being at the sides, or vice versa. Um, so it's a it's a diagonal split. And we're going to each corner, and basically, um, yeah, like I showed, your movement is to this this half of the tile, or this half of the tile, and it's a diagonal split. So you're doing this kind of movement. Um, and if my call out, like if there's too much, 
uh, lag on the call out or trying to figure out which side is which, uh, just watch her. She has different poses for each hit. Um, it's not even a rotation thing because she always faces north. She has a pose for when she's hitting the sides and a pose for when she's hitting the front and back. And you can identify them after seeing them a few times. So, let's see. Uh, what happened in there? With the, the ins and outs, right, a couple people uh, got hit by the cleaves there, so we were just on recovery. And then, um, let me pull up her timeline again, actually. Because if we're in the middle of the fight, at this point, I can remember how things go, but trying to just pull it out of my memory is kind of tough. Okay, so what happens after exchange? Uh, right, she's going to hit with just the regular synergy, which is uh, tanks separated and swap, and then another raid wide. And after the first one, uh, the first one, the raid wide comes first, and then the buster. Every other one after that, after every single buster, there's a raid wide. So uh, first mint will get those. And then transmission. So Transmission put the debuffs on us where um, four people will get a snake on their shoulder and your debuff icon will show like a figure, a silhouette with a snake on a shoulder. And that means you're going to shoot in front of you, so you have to face away. And if you get a, um, like a wing, her the big claw scythe wing that she has, that's going to hit behind you. But I want to try a really clever strat that I saw, instead of doing that at corners and having people actually look away, I've seen people do uh, have the whole raid go south, and the people who get the snake just stand in front of the people who get the wing, and that way all there's nobody in front of the snakes, they all just shoot forward, and the wings are standing behind, there's nobody behind them, they all just shoot back. So we can do something like that. You do still have to dodge the cleaves. But uh, we'll do it in, like, light parties. So if we have to go to the sides, group one will go west and group two will go east. And then when you, uh, and then if you're, if it's uh, front and back, we'll just all be south. Something like that. What we can't do is uh, we can't, like, fully split the party or the snakes are going to shoot across and hit the other group. So even when you are, uh, even if we are east and west, don't go any further than the CRD markers. If you go any further than that, uh, you're going to hit the people across from you. So did we'll try it, that for now. Did it do two cleaves at that part, or was it just... Yes. Me? So that's that's the trick. If it was just as simple as snakes have to look away and that's it, that would be really, really easy. Uh, the trick is that those uh, the cleaves on us are going to um, resolve like a second before she does the first hit of her her half and half uh, attack and it also temporarily stuns you so you have to be in the safe area for the first hit of that attack and then you have to already be holding the movement key and like near you know near the edge so that as soon as that stun wears off you can get out of that section before the second hit so uh, be ready for that it is gonna stun you wait for the stun to actually take effect and then you know, hold W and, and so as soon as you come out of it, you just uh, run out of the section, right? Um, okay. And that's, for, that's another one. Hmm? For the uh, tank swap, we just swap during the cast, right? There's nothing different about it. Oh yeah, once the cast has started, the targets are locked. Okay. So you can you can provoke during the cast. It will still hit cash if cash was uh, main tank when the cast began. Um, okay. So that's for the look forward your way. Uh, the thing after that was the uh, the tiles where I told everybody to go center. Um, that doesn't really... You don't need to think too hard about that. What's happening there is she cast Dark Dome, which is going to uh, basically plant like delayed AoEs uh, wherever players are standing. And I guess you can just think of it as like the, the circles that we bait on Carbuncle, um, but they're smaller and they're invisible. So when Dark Dome finishes casting, every location that a player was standing 
is going to explode with a little AoE a couple seconds later. And what we're going to do is all stack in the center so that all eight AoEs just make one death dome, effectively. And uh, mm -hmm. I will look at the pattern and, and see uh, which tile is safe and let you guys know as soon as Dark Dome is finished casting, we're going to run out into this tile. Um, so it's always going to be one of the four inner tiles, but uh, you want to run out far enough you don't get hit. So basically, stand between the markers, right? I'll say red, yellow, blue, purple, whatever. You go stand between the markers. Um, and that's all there is to that. Uh, the trick there is just when we were progging it, it's like we didn't know what the AoEs, where they were coming from or how they worked. And then you figure out that, oh, they're just baited when the cast finishes. Uh, the thing we saw after that, which, yeah, went really fast, was... Um, you know what, we should probably just see it again, because at this point I've already explained two mechanics. So, I feel like, okay, I'm going to hold off on that one. We'll do another pull. Yeah. Yeah, I think I could, I could use another pull. Yeah. Because we did see a lot. We, we, we pushed through a lot. And then I realized, like, oh, I've already explained two, two brand new mechanics. Let's just, uh, let's just pull again. And, uh... And we're all going close. south for that, um, front or back thing, right? Yeah, so I want to try that because it's, it's really simple and straightforward. But effectively what's going to happen is, uh, when we get to transmission, we'll just all gather, uh close to the boss, we don't have to be too far out, um, gather up south, anybody who gets a snake stands in front, and the people with the wings will just stay a little bit further back, you, do, you don't need to leave melee, trust me, you just, there's just going to be two rows, right, there's going to be a row of four players that are a little bit deeper in, and a row of four players behind them, the wings, and if she hits front and back first, then we'll split off to the left and the right, but don't go any further than the letter markers, right? We're just gonna go far enough that we don't get hit. Um, if you go a full 90 degrees and you have snake, you're gonna shoot across and you're gonna hit the players on the other side. Um, if she hits sides first, then it's fine. We don't have to go anywhere. If she hits sides, uh, all of the cones will go off before the second hit. So they just go off and then we run out of, uh, uh, we run out before the second hit gets us. That's all, all there right. is to it. We just need to practice. Ow, kitty. Where's three? It's over here. Fuck! <laughs> B, what the hell's wrong with me? Okay, so sometimes B looks like a three if you are at tunnel visioning. <laughs> Just so you know. <laughs> and that killed me. Oh my god, Vic. Oh, this is gonna be corners. Uh, I think. Well, we won't get any extra mechanics, so it may still be possible. Do it. Uh, DPS are in. DPS are going in. Tanks and healers are out. Front and back is safe. And then Front switch. and back. Well. Oh. Sorry. I heard that was the switch. 
everything looks like her ass in her face here. I don't know. <laughs> Bam. Wait, what, does that make her a butter face? Butter ass? <laughs> butter face? Um, yeah. Who? And both, yeah, both things need to mint, but, uh... All right, so that started going downhill really early with uh, yeah. bees looking like threes. I don't. Listen, <laughs> listen, it's the phoenix disease. I can't. I don't know what to tell you. <laughs> bees. I phoenix has ruined so me. I, would, I had six, and I know from Cash's previous experience, six goes to two, not to three. So, so we're good. Listen. We could always we could always do uh, evens and odds. You just no. have to do the swaps no. a little faster. No, it's fine. It was just a stupid move. Yes. Okay. Sorry. It's fine. We don't need to change the whole strat no, just because no, I'm no, dumb. No, no, no. It's, <laughs> because the, because the mechanic works exactly the same way. It's it's only a change of positions. But I'm just saying that's an option. We can no, always no. To. <laughs> great right now. Right. We just need to practice. One and flub does not require no, changing no, anything. Gotcha, gotcha. Read read the jazz for you a little bit better. You open just, your fucking open your fucking eyes, great. Ella. To be fair, they're really dumb, like, designs on them, I guess. <laughs> I appreciate the support. <laughs> I mean, yeah, I mean, if you look at them, they're if almost you look at them the quickly, same, the four looks one, like a G. One has a yes. line and the other one has a dot. And yes, I thought it was a G we have a for G. a while. Yeah. If you look at them quickly, sometimes you can get a uh, All right, I'll make it over. At least I can. <laughs> Two is in this time. And this mechanic is so so brain dead. That's the only thing that changes is whether you're slightly brain dead in or not. Or slightly. I have another it's just chance. Whether, on that one, it's just whether you're very slightly in or very slightly out. All right. So five goes out. Six goes out. Seven goes out. And eight goes out. Uh oh. My. Did I, did I fuck up counting again? Oh my god, I did. God. I, have. I, I, got got a, six. I can't. I can't. I can't use it. Oh yeah, I'm six sorry. is the new number. God damn it, Cash. <laughs> Dude, shit. No, this is your fault. <laughs> you did it corners. earlier. To your corner. Fuck. DPS are out. Gets her out. Tanks and healers are in. Sides are safe. Sides. Tanks and healers in? Yes. Uh, you guys. Yeah. Why? If somebody messed up, somebody well, that I was supposed to be. Oh. I think it's no, really me, it but I think I. No, I think. I think oh, was it because? Hard. So no, you said that might have... out, but I had a donut, and I thought donuts go in, so I was like, okay, I go in, but. It oh, but you also had a you also had a you tether. had a tether, yeah. Yes. Yeah. So it swapped at the last second. Yeah. Yeah. The, the swap, oh, the swap that takes place right. Okay. Yeah. So the swap takes place right before they all go off. Yeah. So if you have right. a tether, you're the opposite of whatever's over your head. Okay, great. All right, I got that. We're I'll just listening to what Ray says, which is. That's okay. I mean, I explain like why because. No, it's all right. All the GPS I, I are gonna get the now. same thing and all that. Yeah. Uh, why, I'm, why I won't the be case? dumb again, I promise. Yeah. Make promises. I said that last Keep. run, and I proved that that was false. <laughs> like, I didn't say I wasn't a liar. That turned out to be a lie. <laughs> so I can't read, and I can't do math tonight. Okay. <laughs> I'm on a fucking roll. <laughs> Whatever. We still cleared five. Mm-hmm. All works out. Yeah, we're learning. This is learning. The question is, can we clear five in like one or two shots next week? Mm. We can get Maybe we'll here. get better at that too. Can I ask again when second so. mitt's supposed to do anything? Yeah. Uh, second mitt can get the tank busters. Um, the synergy. Yeah. But in general, very there's. Useful. Yeah, there's not much well for second mid to do because I'm gonna mid the corners. Fuck it, I keep dying there. <laughs> yeah, but it's it's because the raid wides are all spaced out, like at least uh, 90 seconds apart, so we can debuff every single one of them with just one group. Gonna do the right map. So six goes to two. Yes, yeah, thank you. 
Uh, Come on, let me prove seven, that I know seven. how to count. <laughs> seven go out. Eight go out. Uh, well, I okay. To be fair, I didn't even <laughs> see who got it. That was me. <laughs> it just because it's like I know that's that's the cursed number. That's the problem number. All right, to your corners. Everybody, go to your corners. So watch her pose. Nobody right, puts the baby in a front corner. Side thing. DPS are going in. DPS are in. Thanks and healers are out. Sides. Sides are safe. Sides are safe. And then switch to the front or back. Uh oh. What happened? Okay. Uh, Vic and Ella, I think. Uh, Ella, you were probably the stack in that case, I think. Um, but that was too far from the center. So uh -oh. the same. Well, she was standing, standing right on. I was standing next. Yeah, I was standing next. To or were you the were you the donut? Well, I'm just guess. I'm guessing that oh, you were because I don't know. I'll look. <laughs> you know what? I'll look at it later. Shoot, <laughs> I, I was not paying attention to what was happening. I wasn't alive Sorry last time we had to be in the middle, so I. It's very possible. Um, I think, yeah. Oh. No, I'm just it, guessing based on what I thought. Is this the uh, like inner thing? So, I got wing. Yeah, everybody go south, and, and then... the people who have snakes should be in front of the people who have wings. Okay. And you'd want to go to the sides first. Sides? Oh, no! And then, hey, and then I you go back into the south. Right. right. Oh. <laughs> Saw that way too late. <laughs> hey, Ozzy Maniac. Yeah, still going. I've, I've got a long paying attention to the pole after, after a bit there. Uh, everyone stack center. Like, dead center. Right under her feet. Uh, wait for Dark Dome to finish casting, and then go to yellow. And just go between the two yellow. No. Ooh. So see, it's just a giant death dome in the center, and one safe pile. Alright, all tanks and healers between A and D, and all the DPS between B and C. If you get a stack marker, you are going out. Gonna swap. That's me. Cloud, you need to be on the other side. Which huh? You said A and between A and B? A and D, know. that's what you said. I don't know what to do with this marker. I'm just gonna run over here. The uh, oh. If you get the stack marker, you're leaving the group. If you get the other Which one, one? Stack marker is so there's three markers, it, right? So yeah. Uh hang on. So the stack marker looks exactly the same as a stack telegraph. Just oh, no. it's just two oh. D over your just... head. She just looked at me and I died. <laughs> All right, hang on, hang on. I'll grab a screenshot. Um, since I got it that time, it yeah. looks just like the three D, uh, the three D stack telegraph, but it's a two D uh, animation of your head. So it's, it's like completely, completely different than what I'm used to doing. Okay, um, so that that is like every single every single attack so far. Okay, I got it. Yeah, it's like more yellow than orange. What about the? So I put it, I put it in the oh, P6 okay. channel. Yeah. I put a picture of it in the P6 channel. Uh, obviously, my my square marker is on top of it, but it just looks like the stack, uh, telegraph. If you get that, you're going out because. So for this mechanic, um, there's going to be two people that get stack marks and two people that get the AOE marks, and they will always be tethered to each other. So both stacks will be tethered to an AoE, and both AoEs will be tethered to a stack, which just means that 100% of the time, uh, you're just going to get the opposite mechanic of what it shows. So that's all. There's actually no, uh, there's no randomness other than who gets each marker. Um, but the people who get that spread marker will always be the stacks at the end, and the people who get the stacks will always be the AoEs. Um, now, where I went, where I went is not where I would tell you guys to go in this actual mechanic. Um, I was just getting far away so that I wouldn't hit anybody. Um, but what I would say, uh, I have a, hold on a sec, I have an image that I already made that I can grab from another group to show uh, for that. Oh. <laughs> okay, well, you might not want to here. Uh, maybe don't put this one on the stream because it's uh, it's another group. It's got like 
stuff on it. I don't know if they'd want that to be streamed. Okay. But um, this is something I drew over uh, for another group that I was helping out. And I made my own little, like, stack and spread things. If everybody was max melee, 90 degrees apart, you can get everyone uptime. But for now, for safety, um, the spread should just go out a little bit further. And their markers are different, but for us, that would mean that uh, the groups are on B and D, and this, the people going out would be uh, at like one in three, approximately. Since, uh, since the cones, when the cones go off, uh, B and D will be safe after the cones go off. So, make sense? Maybe, I think so. Okay. Um, what, what was the other thing that happened there? I was on the wrong was side. Of, no, I was just wondering, was there uh, a mechanic before that? Huh. Oh, well, we passed, yeah, the, the whole debuffs with the snake and wing. All right, I'm not going to worry about that. Uh, what was the other thing? Oh, on the, um, when we go to the corners the first time, uh, I call that mechanic exchange because you get, you get mechanics and they flip with each other. But um, if you are in, you need to be really close in. And yeah. Let me grab a frame. Right, it was. Oh, that had it. What? Oh, so what actually happened here? Was that the, co the donuts? Yeah, it must be. It was. Okay. Uh, this one you can show. This is uh, this is our group that I'm posting right now. I don't see anything that can't really be shown it, on the other one. I, I just not, don't know. No, I, I, don't I, I haven't that. asked him. I haven't asked him if he's fine with with me sharing that stuff and whatever. It's just a, a courtesy thing. Yeah, yeah. Because it's another streamer. I don't think so. Uh, so this one's fine. If you see, so X is so deep that you are literally in the center, and so it would, I think at that range, it would be impossible to even know if you're front back or if you're sides. So you don't want to be on the actual center because you're basically flipping a coin whether you get hit or not. Mm -hmm. uh, but Vic is so far out that Vic and I hit each other with our donuts. And you want to be about where I am, basically within the first two of those, uh, the smaller tiles. So obviously not the big giant tiles, but the little tiles that make make them up. You want to be like within the first two, about where I am. And I think Ella Ella's position was also fine. We just hit each other with our donuts because we were a little bit too far out. Now, It'll if you closer. do it, yeah. So if you're positioned like me, you can be on either side and it'd be fine. Um, but what Nath was suggesting before is that if we all agree on two corners to use, like south and east, uh, and then everybody went south or east to, to dodge, um, then we would be even closer to each other without having to get this close to the boss. But I think as, if you're within two tiles, um, it'll reach across. It's just in this case, uh, Vic didn't come in deep enough. So, that's what happened there. Nice. <laughs> nice. Well, uh, it's very yeah, big. Okay, I got one last, go one last try. One last try. Alrighty. Make it count. I've been fighting off the itis. Sorry, <laughs> itis. The, the wings reaper flips right oh, back to right. chicken wings. Well, what would you do that for? Because it's all you can eat fucking chicken. <laughs> nice. How many can you eat? <laughs> uh, I ate over 30. What the? Oh, man. Pushing the boundaries. Like three plates. The first plate's like 15. The second two plates are usually about 10. Human excellence. Four plates. There's a reason four plates sounds like four play. <laughs> I also had a frozen margarita with it. It was delicious. <laughs> I just love margaritas. I don't know why. I only like the flavored ones. They're delicious. I'm okay. Uh, 
We had boozy milkshakes last night with our dinner. Uh, my group is in. Okay, numbers. Ah, uh, this bitch really wants to remind me what <laughs> six goes to. I'm telling you. We'll never forget now. Five move out. Whoa. Six move out. Seven move out. Eight move out. Alright. So, let's back up. Next mechanic is uh, corners. So, like I said, exchange of agonies. I just call it mechanic exchange. We get mechanics. Next look. DPS are out. Gets her out. Takes the loser in. Front and back are safe. And switch. Up. I think I know what happened. Uh, I got X. Uh, by the way, so Vic, it is actually totally safe. Oh, both tanks need to mit. Both tanks mit and swap. Uh, it is completely safe to come back in after the first hit because all, okay. the, other, all the other mechanics, like the ins and outs, have already gone off. Uh, they go off on the first one. So you can come in, but if it was in and out first, you need to come in on the side. And if it was sides first, you need to come in from behind. Yeah, That's I got it. Hopefully. Okay, all right, everybody comes out. Here? Everybody come to the south. People who get uh, wings be in the back row, snakes be in the front row, and just oh. so snakes need to be under the boss. Snakes, uh, uh, Ella, Vic. And... Wait, I'm so confused. Okay. <laughs> mm. Like, I got cloud. It's okay, like we, we gotta be under the boss, but we gotta avoid the sides of the boss. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> they're cones. So they're cones. So always, even if you're under the boss, that doesn't mean you're going to get hit. If you're under the boss, but you're in front or behind her, you're still not going to no, get like, hit. No, like, I get that, but it's like I'm trying to figure out where Center. I should be standing without blowing up other people. Yeah, I'll show up in this. Uh, we'll go to yellows. Go between yellows. Yeah, okay. So before we call it a night, I'll just show what I mean by the uh, by rose real quick. All right, um, tanks and healers in the west, DPS in the east, and Ix and Cash need to go out. Oh, and Vic is here on the west side. Yeah, that's not, so that's not light parties, that's uh, roll based. That's roll based. We need all the tanks and healers on one side and all the Oh, on the you're side. switching up sides on me, okay. It's just, it's only for that one mechanic. I, yeah, no, oh, I don't think no, you want to be on top of me for that. I was, Forgot we were supposed was, to move. No, 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 no. That we weren't. Um, that was the the split tank buster, and oh, Rod you were dead. busting it. Oh. Rod was dead, so I was second. I was just. You said we were gonna follow you, it's okay. so I'm just blindly following you. So here, look. Before before we go, let me just show what I mean uh, by the rose for transmission. So. Uh, just, just, I'm just gonna pick at random. Um, Vic, can you stand where I am? Jumping. Boop. And then I'm gonna say, uh, X. Actually, yeah. wait, if it was, if it was X, you'd be, you'd want to be on the right side anyway. So, here, right here. Uh, and let's pull a range. So, let's say Neff. Neff, uh, can you stand where I'm jumping? And then, um, I don't know who else is in my group. Uh, I wanna make two. Uh, Rod. I don't have both healers in the front. Okay. Uh, let's say that Vic, Naf, Ix, and Rod were all of the snakes. And then, yeah, and the rest of us, Cash, Ella, Cloud, and myself, all had the wings. If we're like this, and everybody is just hitting the boss, right? They're just, you're facing the boss, you're doing attacks or whatever. Um, all of the snakes are in the front row, and you're all just going to shoot forward, and because you're standing side by side, uh, there's nobody in front of you, so you're not going to hit anybody. And we all, all of us in the back have the wing debuff, and we're all standing side by side, and we're behind you. There's nobody behind any of us, so ours will shoot, will shoot back, and they won't hit anybody either. And if we did, uh, if she did her pose, and she did 
show that she was going to hit front and back first, we would split up and basically come over by the, uh, the D and C markers because uh, those cones are really narrow. So even if I was a snake, like standing here, I would shoot across and I would hit somewhere around A. But as long as you guys weren't too far forward, you wouldn't get hit by it anyway. So we would come over here first if it was uh, if it was sides, and then after the front uh, sides safe, I mean. And then after the front and back hit, and uh, we get stunned, we shoot the cones forward and back. It would just make a giant X. And then as soon as our stun wears off, we want to get out of the side so the second cleave doesn't hit us. And that's uh, that's that way of doing it. The way my groups do it is we go to our corners, like, with the other mechanic, the exchange, and then anybody who gets a snake just faces away. But in that case, snakes lose up time. I saw somebody, like, do this. Oh, Chris, you cued this? It's so simple. Interesting pick. I like it. I want to try it. <laughs> I don't know what it... it sounds I, I, like something that might be from Mother... But it's from that's, Pokemon? That's what I meant by huh. uh, front row and back row. Is you just, you Lavender just Town. Right, stand shoulder to shoulder. Okay, I didn't um, think we could be that close. So anything anything that's a cone, the only thing that matters... Brawly, with a VIP be, or ban. If, Let's see if what happens. A cone, I can be like this with Naf, like literally clipping into Naf, and as long as we're actually side by side... Um, because player hitboxes are a, a point. Player hitboxes don't have width, right? They Broly! Don't have They're just a single point. So, uh, Congratulations. Not in that angle uh, in front of me, he wouldn't get hit. And it's the same thing with the boss. Um, you can be... A new VIP. Look at, that I posted. Look at the screenshot that I posted. Uh, On this yeah, beautiful day. About where I was standing. It's Broly. Because when the actual cone comes out... Cleared P5. Um, new VIP. It, it narrows down to a single point. Blessed stream. Do we do we not have to be closer to the inner cardinal lines for that? Like, is there enough time to run from when, the center to the out? Yeah, so when she shows where that she's going to hit the front and back, we do have enough time... Another one! We can go Keanu, please, go is redeemed inside. VIP or and ban. Let's see what happens. Set up again, right? Because Let's see what happens. Could it be? And then you go to the position and get it again. And it's pretty fine. But you're right. Uh, oh, the other thing is I'm showing I'm showing you this far back because I don't want to pull the bus. But when we actually do it, we, we could be really close. So, damn shame. Where we just practice it. We just practice. What a shame. It we'll get the hang of it. Anyway, uh, that's all. No, oh, what the heck? You're banned for now, yeah, Keanu. No, people need to go. I'm not doing another poll. But um, no, that's all. It's gonna be something. I'm sure. I'm sure. Probably some people are going to. Uh, maybe not. Red Thanks for watching, though, Keanu. Thank you. Back and stay in it, but that's not a problem because they'll just shoot right up the middle. Um, maybe some people will like move at the last second. They'll still be headed there and they'll shoot the group in front of them. But Gosh. these are all things that, like, as long as everybody understands what we're trying to do, mm -hmm. uh, it's just a matter of practice. Agro <laughs> Send you my repair bill. I'll repair for you. Just... Um, Congrats on P5 clear, everybody. That's pretty cool. Hmm? We cleared hey, P5. So next week, we all good? Any any absences or anything? Uh, I'm just going over my work schedule. I'm opening up my work schedule right now. Real quick, one sec. Because cool, cool, cool. I do know my schedule gets a little jumpy around. No, like, I was kidding, dude. It's fine. <laughs> I just want to make sure I know red days. It is the fifth. It is the next Monday. It is. So let's see. Okay. All day. So here, I'm going to put another. So the fifth, I will be late if I do show up because I'm one to nine. All so right. that's one hour after raid start, unfortunately. All right. We'll plan on subbing you out this time. 
Um, yeah, that's fine. And then just let me know if that changes. Yep. Um, <laughs> and then honestly, for I think that's literally the only day because yeah, for the rest of uh, the rest of December and January, I'm either off on Mondays or I work eight to five. So. So Vic, um, or actually, yeah, anybody else, uh, I don't know if there's anybody else that was asking about it. I put one more screenshot that is basically, it's a couple seconds after the last one that I posted. It's from the same, uh, same poll of the second hit. And you see, um, those cleaves, when they're under her, they narrow down to a point. So you could be like three feet behind her and you would be safe. The only thing you yeah, don't want to be dead center. If you're dead center, you're yeah, flipping a coin. Yeah, I can read um, it. Oh no. I love that sound. Go quiet. Very quiet. Very quiet. No, yeah, yeah, it's quiet. quiet. Sounded like you're a little far away from the mic. Oh, who me? No, no. nah. No. Oh. Nah. Are you? Shit. Anyway. Uh, yeah, that's just what I wanted to illustrate, and it's the same idea with the. Uh, with the snakes and wings, except the snakes and wings are much, much narrower. The snakes and wings are like, they're like 10 degree cones instead of 90 degrees, or however, I don't know. Uh, I don't know what the actual number is, but they're extremely narrow. So as long as you're not standing right in front or behind another person, uh, you're not gonna hit them. And let me get, yeah, right here I got, yeah, some examples of them going off. You can look at, um, Ella's, I think, is the best example in this, because Ella pretty much shot hers directly away from my camera. And you can see, if you were to either side... Uh, okay, well, the picture hasn't finished yet, but if you were to either side of Ella... Uh, in the yeah, the, there was just something on my... Uh, something on my washing machine that, like, rattled off and it hit the floor, so I just went to go pick it up. It becomes white, like, at a really great distance it becomes white, but if you're close... Or, yeah, just line up. It's not even it's not even that important to have a particular order or anything. Just don't be directly in front or behind uh, someone else with the same same view as you. And so we'll just have you know four snakes in the front, four wings in the back, and then dodge dodge the cones if we need to. So that's all. Cool. Yeah. Seems doable. And maybe maybe next week uh, start learning Kekexia and hopefully that won't be as bad as it went uh, as it was for my groups because if that's another case of uh, there's a better strat out now than what we do. Awesome. So I'll teach you guys that. Right on. Yeah, thanks, Ray. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Right, well, I'll see you later. Have a good night, everybody. Right. Good night, everybody. Good night, guys. See you next week. Yeah. Um, you're asking about Devil and Me? I don't think so because um, Steph's actually making some office furniture, so I think I'm gonna help her build that and help her get situated if I can. Um, so I'm gonna shut down the stream for now, but thank you all very much for watching. Uh, yeah, sorry about that. Maybe tomorrow. So tomorrow is a full streamer gamer day. Um, not writing inside games tomorrow, so I get to stream all day uninterrupted it's gonna be nothing but cozy gamer times um might be god of war i think it'll probably be god of war uh, i know i know you can kind of tell a lot of people don't really want to see that and i kind of get that too i wouldn't want to watch streams of that if i hadn't played it yet so maybe i'll mix some other things in there just kind of even it out a little bit might finish up Mega Man x3 do some f-zero i don't know it's gonna be a, it's gonna be a big gamer day i know there are a lot of those Whatever, it's December. Almost December. It's big gamer time. <laughs> Here's my wallpaper. Anyway, thank you all very much for watching. Uh, maybe we'll get some more uh, Devil in Me tomorrow. But uh, appreciate it very much. Uh, hope you all enjoyed it. Um, and if not, guess what? I'll be even better tomorrow. I'll be gaming better. I'll be funnier, more insightful, more relaxing. Everything you love. All right, catch you next time. Have a good night, everybody.